you're being pathetic You can about a bacteria in the fridge It's getting boring But packing bags due to Dirty socks I threw to Clamshade shrimp Order some anodons gone Then I explicated Are you still not persuaded? There's grass growing on your time Panic membrane Remember to pull yourself Sacrifices and oh gosh Now I have to start all over again Start all over again Just boosted BG3. Wow. Only the most epic tales feature cool depictions of saw blades crushed into cable boat walls. The attempt is all blunt, stunned, affected goals and planned, which surely can be blamed on Rufus at all. Reckoning up the sun, the best was yet to come. For the end of part one seemed a little too coarse, and to amend we'll send him to attend a second chance for a decent happy end with a grand fling, with dancing and blues and so forth. Huzzah with blues and so forth. Just boosted Hello. Diablo 3. Adam C. Luna just boosted Mass Effect 3.
boosted Banner Saga 1. Thor Obliterator just boosted Banner Saga 2. Thor Obliterator just boosted SR, returns. Jotiler's just boosted Cronder 2. Jotiler's just boosted Waste Hey, hey, hey. Jotiler's just boosted Chrono T. Oh. Underscore Boga just missed I am not a slave. No. Oh. Underscore Boga just missed it too. No. Oh. Underscore Boga just missed it S2. Hello everybody, welcome, what is it, it's Tuesday, happy Tuesday, welcome Parrots, Pi, Multi, Thor, QP, Bogu, Adam, Jatlers, and all the lurkers, thanks for joining me early in the stream, hope you're having a fine Tuesday, not a busy day, welcome Pug, it's Mitral Day, it's, it's Pug Day, it's G's Guys Day, welcome, good to see you all, hope you're all resting and relaxing, and ready for some more chaos on Diponia because everyone knows to make the most of the chaos you need to go into it well relaxed so that you can enjoy it fully yes uh, after a uh, after a two-day break at the expense of Thor we are back to streaming it, it, it was a uh, hey Draven welcome it's time for more chaos hell yeah hell yeah it's time for more chaos heck yes how are you Draven Welcome, good to see you as well. Yeah, I had a nice two day Great break. to see you again. Some nice wrestling, some nice Ultima Online. I met QP and Drummer for coffee. Uh, the, the day, uh, like Sunday, my first break day, it was extremely hot and sunny. It sapped all my energy and I was scared for yesterday. But, you know, thankfully yesterday when we actually met, it was pretty chill and windy and cool, so it was a good day. And now I'm ready. It's not taking a break from video games to play some media. Exactly, that is that is the thing. Being fine to get computer outside to get some fresh air. Ah, that sounds so nice. Very cool. Is it uh, so? It's not very hot out. I assume the weather is so fine where you are usually. Um, yeah, we are, we are going back to Chaos on Deponia. Let's, let's do the boost first. So yeah, uh, for those who may not know, I finished on Saturday. I Only by joining the five could I discover who the others were. And it was, it was really cool. I'm, I'm glad I got to play that game. That game with a history on critical hits. But I'm glad people... 
I'm also glad that it wasn't rushed, like it started like um, with the cult and all. Uh, but I'm also glad people didn't really give up on it and it got selected eventually. It was really good fun. And I think I, I motivated, the streams motivated a few people to also start and play the game. Draven included, possibly Draven. Maybe you will stream it as well. That would be so cool to see you stream it. I know you are installing it. I know you plan to play it. Maybe you'll get to stream it. And I'll get to watch this time. We'll be streaming. That's perfect. That's so good. So yeah, I check out Draven for sure. He always plays some cool games and he's the he's the coolest and the chillest streamer I know. So um, definitely deserves a follow if you are not familiar with his content. But yeah, more Arx Fatalis will be very cool. But we are uh, we are past that now. We are past Arx Fatalis. It's done. It's completed. We got a new game selected just because of the weather here in Scotland. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> I bet. We will start Torment. I was going to start it on Sunday, but I I said, you know, I'll take another day of rest, and um, if I start a new Criticalist title on Sunday, it always feels kind of bad to wait until the next Friday to continue. So I thought I'll start it fresh on a Friday. We'll play it three days in a row. I'm very, very excited. I'm very, very happy to play Torment, especially because it has been months since we last played a proper tactical classic RPG. Uh, classic CRPG in the way of Baldur's Gate and all the all those great games. Uh, Torment. Since Kingmaker. It's been like... I think it was March when we finished Kingmaker. So it's been five months, six months. It'll be very cool. We are going to start it Friday. But of course today and tomorrow we are going to continue Chaos on Deponia. And uh, I... Okay, I'll get to it later actually. Let's... Let's do the boosts first. What's Sacred. Long Draven hearts. just boosted Nom Nom 8. Nom Nom 8. And Baldur's Gate. Dungeon Siege. Diablo. Draven just boosted an Acronox. Banner Sagas 1 and 2. Shadowrun Returns. Rondor. Why is this here? Wait, this is wrong. Uh, Krondor. Wasteland. You see what you know I all your single boosting out again. You forget them. No worries. Whenever you remember it, it's fine. I could help you remember it if it's one of the games you boosted before. And Bogus, almost indecipherable three games. I can only figure them out because uh, it's the same three. And The Witcher 3. Was a different one? That's fine. Uh, take your time. No worries, no rush at all. Thank you for the boost, multi Pi, QP, Adam, Thor, Jatlers, and Bogu. And also Draven for the first two. Let's boost them as well. There we go. We'll get to the third one later. So. Turn this on a little bit more. So I installed Chaos on Deponia, the standalone game, the original release, not the complete edition. And I found a, I found an appropriate save game. And um, hey, Grand underscore Master underscore Farmer has just shared for 100 bits. Today's European history lesson: Albunia, also known as Albania, was the name of England until the mighty warlord Jean-Luc Picard conquered the British Isles in 1426. And united the five rowdy caveman tribes under Saruman's blessing. Wow, I never heard that. And I'm a history buff. 
um, that is uh, that is really exceptional bits of history there, GM Farmer. Thank you so much for sharing it with us, and thank you for so much for the hundred bits as well. Uh, it's good to see you. Hope you are doing great. Um, yeah, that is really interesting. You know, we we should we should share stuff like that more often. Wikipedia taught you so much. <laughs> I bet. I'd like to see that Wikipedia. That Wikipedia looks a lot more interesting than the one I usually use. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I installed the standalone, the original Draven release of. Oh, there we go. Is this some warriors? Which you don't which own is yet, but ours. one way or another, one day. Smiley yeah, face. one day. It's gonna happen. So uh, yeah, I want to say something about these games I don't own yet. I I have said this on occasion. We were talking with. Uh, QPN drummer when we met yesterday and we were talking about these games on hold and um, I just want to say that if these games kind of discourage you from boosting them even though you want them hey Ash welcome happy Tuesday hope you're doing well uh, don't let them discourage you because we were talking about cyberpunk actually and uh, how i didn't have it and how people wouldn't boost it because i didn't have it because it was on hold uh, if these games get really a nice amount of boosts like to rival those up there and i still don't have them uh, i will get them you know if, if if cyberpunk would sit on the fourth place or any of these games would sit on the fourth place with the amount of boosts they had uh, I, I would get them somehow, like I, I would buy them, I would spare the budget to get them. I just want I just wanted to repeat that, I said this before, but maybe it's, it still may stop some people from uh, boosting. Of course that doesn't, that doesn't really go for games that are locked behind others. Like New Vegas would be locked behind Fallout 3, Fallout 4 would be locked behind New Vegas. I wouldn't play them if they would still uh, get in a poll. I would have to play the previous game before. That goes for the games that are marked uh, as uh, those I don't own. And there are plenty of them. So I just wanted to repeat that in case someone was, you know, someone had doubts about it. Barbie Horse Adventures Chaos on Deponia. Yes, we are going to cause chaos on all the horses and the equine population. So uh, let me get back to what I was saying before. Uh, I installed the original release of Chaos on Deponia, that's the one that's outside uh, the complete edition, and I found an appropriate save game to get to the puzzle that was bugged for us, and uh, I, I got us a working version of puzzle. So we are going to start by solving that puzzle, and then I'm going to jump back into our save game. Uh, I really felt bad about having to skip that one, so I looked for a solution, and I'm I'm very glad I was able to find the solution. Uh, so that's how we are going to jump into the game today, and uh, you know, no better time, no better time than now to jump into it now. Let's let's go see what that puzzle is about. Let's go see if it was worth the hassle. Okay, once more, thank you so much for uh, joining the stream today. As early as you did. Always a pleasure to see you all. Uh, let me start the timer. This is a little loud. So the bug wasn't present in the standalone version. Well, I don't know what exactly the bug is, Pi, but it just didn't happen in this version. See, the, the egg is here now. So I am not exactly sure what causes it. Maybe it's some sort of remastering error. Uh, with regards to the FPS or whatever uh, because I did all I can with the FPS settings and the other kinds of settings I tried a lot after stream as well I tried after stream as well and it just didn't work so I thought to do this you're not going to get into a stream Iraq, Syria and Turkey has your favorite history in Europe from say 200 years back 4000 years oh yeah um, I understand why you would say that the um, these lands have been kind of cradle of civilization um, so uh, yeah, but yeah, I, I actually, you know, from the from jokes aside, I'm not very knowledgeable on history. Uh, that being said, honestly speaking, talking about history, you know, historical facts, it's it's not the same as you know talking about politics and stuff. So if you do want to get about it, I wouldn't have any qualms with it. Um, but I I just don't know much. But yeah, these these um, these lands are really beautiful and uh, have a huge history behind them for sure so i understand why i would say that anyway okay let's let's start with the puzzle yeah well 
Yeah, exactly. Okay, so what exactly hey, is happening? Hey, stop right there. I don't think I can pull this off without tools. Perhaps these two rocks and the meerkat trap over there could help. So let's see what kind of moves he makes. Looks like he moves like a knight. Uh, moves uh, two one direction, one the other direction. So if we put it here, the, the only location... So if I block this and if I put the trap here, let's see what happens. Ah, oh, okay, my fault. I... For some reason, I didn't see that. Well, that should be easy now. What? You cheater. What if I block this as well? Ah, gotcha. All you right. thought you could fool me, didn't you? But the wiser man never gives in. All right. <laughs> well, <laughs> well this, this is the puzzle that I uh, broke my mind over trying to fix the bug but now we solved it now <laughs> this was kind of you know anticlimactic i think that's okay though. i'm i'm happy that we got to it <laughs> uh. <laughs> thank you pie hi lord and has just cheered for 50 bits gg puzzle master thank you for the bits anticlimactic was what you were looking for yeah it was <laughs> you know, I waited them. I uh, oh wait, what, what, what's climax? What's the what's the problem with the capture? I waited a week to solve that puzzle to look at it. Okay, uh, give me a moment. I'm not sure why the capture isn't working. Truly <laughs> a puzzle of all time, exactly. I just tested this. Uh, so if I. Reload the save. What's going on here? Okay, uh, let me... Let me look at this real quick. Get rid of... There's on the pony. While it's capturing now. It's... What the heck? Alright, that's interesting. Well, you know. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, we can... There is no understanding these kind of errors that happen with, you know, all the software, but, you know, since I've been working a lot it's with fine. OBS and other streaming stuff lately, recently, last three years or so, there is no understanding how some, uh, you know, errors just pop up randomly, even though it works for like a month straight, and suddenly it doesn't, and now suddenly it's fixed again. It's really weird. Anyway, let's go back to the game. So before we go back to the game, what were we actually doing? So what we are doing right now is trying to hatch uh, the four element and uh, elemental platypus eggs. Your sound card works perfectly. W welcome to the stream. Thank you for, for the follow. Um, hope you have a good time here. Uh, and we did manage to do two of those. We hatched them and we would put them in their nests to guard the nests. Now, this is a third one. Uh, the fire, no, the air, a platypus egg, and we have, uh, we have done much with this, but we haven't been able to. I think we haven't been able to discharge it, right? That's um, we have been able to shoot it. You watched 19 of my 18 streams last month. Really? Wow, that is so cool. <laughs> that is so cool, Ash. How did you do that? Did you did you watch one of them twice, or did you watch the secret stream that I thought no one watched? You just get used to the things doing that. Yeah, you're right. You get used to it and yet you just try to fix it again. That was one very secret stream that even I wasn't aware of. A an accidental stream. And even Twitch didn't know about that. How did you how did you learn? How did you know that? Did it catch the midnight? <laughs> Wait, oh no. Oh yeah, that wasn't on Twitch, that was on uh, my OnlyFans. No, what was what was that website called? My fan? No. My all my fans? Something. Well, I'm, I'm embarrassed that you watched that stream. Anyway, so we are going to Pony <laughs> My Pony Fans. Yes, the website was called My Pony Fans. So we need to find some way to shoot this so it hatches in the air. And that's why we got stuck with life. Well, we didn't really got stuck. We just ran out of time. So hope you have a good time. Hope you enjoy <laughs> the stream. Exactly. I just have to untie the knot and then... Hey, 
What's going on? I can't get this stupid knot open. Yeah, we weren't able to. Why did I have to be such a gifted knotter? We weren't able to untie this knot, so uh, I think we need to cut <laughs> it or my platypus. I just and then. Um. So how do we do that? We don't have anything. Can we do something Welcome with the pipe? Half <laughs> hmm. Well, let's let's try releasing it again. Lint. Hey, there's a heap of ashes in there that I dumped into the flagomat. Maybe I can use them again. The ashes are here, so if we put these here, it releases a little bit. So maybe at this point we My can untie. I just need to no, that's not it. Um, can I insert the screwdriver? I no. That should insufficiently taut. Um... Hey, maybe I... All right, all right. So it's stretched again. And now we cannot open the knot. Huh. Well, maybe we are missing something else. Let's let's work a little bit on the water egg. That's one I absolutely have no idea about, by the way. Actually, I do have one idea about it. I think According it involves... And zebra I think it involves... Uh... Picking up the swordfish at the tavern. But how to do that, I don't know. I think it might involve picking up this razor fish. And. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What did that just say with the aquarium? Um. Water platypuses in the mouths of living zebra fish? <laughs> it also it maybe zebra fish. Uh it did say zebra fish with the aquarium in our father's room, right? Huh, okay, okay. Let's go back there. Oh, I've rarely seen such what good things so What am I so trying rare. to build? Hands off the ornamental fish. Hey, I just wanted to pet them. I said no. Aw, oh, man. So he doesn't want... What if we give them Hands bread? Hands off the... Oh. Hmm. Water. They have enough water. I don't want it to... There's already enough lint from... Let's try using already. this on yeah. everything. I don't want... There's a quick... Uh, it's... There's nothing it's about. There's no... I want... Or whatever. My things, but it's not this toilet, but I, except for. Why don't bars ever have anything like cayenne pepper or rat? The idea, it should, I don't want this. <laughs> so, not only do we have to find a way to catch this fish, which I think bread may be Hands involved, off. but our father is kind of stopping us from doing that. Let's try talking to him. Hey, Dad. <sighs> what is it now? Can't you see you? I haven't told you. Uh, what else have Now it's in the... Um, stop. What do you want? What was the platypus dishes? I don't there need is just no... too late. I are... uh, don't there is no not... new uh, lines. So maybe we have to either keep him busy or get him out of there if he wanted zebra fish. We cannot put this here, right? According to the field guide, water platypuses hatch their young in the mouths of living zebra fish. And zebra fish are freshwater fish. Hmm. But wait, where am I getting the idea that these are zebra fish? It says goldfish. Maybe it doesn't have anything to do with this at all. I think maybe I misheard the first time. Hmm. Well, okay, uh, let's focus on my original idea. Razorfish. Hey, hold still! Oh, oh, it seems to have some sort of motion sensor. Motion sensor? So if we become invisible... 
I'll catch this fish. Maybe if he become invisible. I'll catch. I'll catch. I'll catch. Nothing works, right? I'll catch. Uh, so about becoming invisible, we need this thing for another puzzle as well. But I don't know how to get it. Hmm. So we can pick this stuff up for testing purposes. I would really like to try out this, but not with. Uh, what? But that's. The so the way he says, but not with my own stuff. I feel like when you pick these up, they are not your stuff. So maybe it requires using one of these, but then again, the shop on that stops you. Welcome to you are how many? Huh? Uh -huh. uh -huh. All right, all right. Hmm. Juicer hat. So. We cannot use stuff with stuff. Excuse but I would like to point out to you. We can put it back. We can put it back. Maybe we have to put something that is similar but not quite that. Excuse but I Like this looks... What does it look like? Does it look like a platypus? It kind of reminds me of the platypus. Platypi. No, platypod. Was it platy? Platypod. Platypody. Platypods. Indestructible sunglasses. So this is not a hot spot. We cannot put that back. I don't want it to get it. There's already. That already. You know, and this thing can be used with items. I bet that it's set. There's nothing. It's a. There's it no. I want to My thing, but not this toilet. But I accept. Quite like or the I. It's a two. Excuse oh, oh. me, sir, but I would like. Not even if there. It is impossible oh, oh. for the indestructible. Wait, I did figure out something. Eternal darkness to be broken. They are indestructible. Wait, interesting. This is original. <laughs> Excuse me, but I would like not even if they're broken. It is impossible for the indestructible sunglasses of eternal darkness to be broken. They are indestructible. They are indestructible. The sunglasses of eternal darkness. Looks like normal sunglasses, just that the lenses are covered in black paint. Cool. Oh, okay, that gives me an idea. There was some white paint, right? There was some white paints near Doc's place. So what if we find a way to pick up the white paints and we, uh -huh. we paint the sunglasses? Let's see. White, of all things, the wet blanket among colors. How can we pick some white paints up? With shred of toilet paper? Would that work? Black would be better. With flames glued to the side. And maybe... Yeah, yeah. Um... Lint? Black with a... Black with a... I'm just... And there. Dab, dab. Wait. Wait, I'm doing Blort. something. Oh, that should be enough. What? What am I doing? I'm just correcting a key. Ah, never mind. I'm just I, th I thought I sold something. Better not. Or I won't be able to tell. Oh, wait, I have I another have idea. I don't have time to actually. worry about typos. Why else did they delic hire that sexy editor? <laughs> so maybe this white paint is actually going to be used to make the razorfish into a zebra fish. That makes more sense to me, actually. But we, we don't have the razor Black fish just yet. And maybe me Black with and maybe me hmm. sugar dispenser. Black with and me Black with and me 
Black with me. Tana. Black with me. Black with me. Okay, um. So we cannot pick up the white paint just yet. I haven't really tried much with these things. Hey, GGG, welcome. How are you doing, Goblin? Good to see you. I have the cartridges. I have a strange device that operates on high voltage current. What could possibly go wrong? Well, it was worth a try. A little more power here certainly couldn't hurt. Don't play around if you aren't careful. Grumbled. So. A little more power. So this is Don't the generic error. You... Grum... That is the generic error. A little more power. Don't you... Grum... There's a specific error for these. I wish I'd had one. Of... I have the cartridge. What could? Well, but the outcome is the same. The fear, but maybe oh, oh. I can hatch the egg with targeted electrical shocks. Ow! Never mind. These are all <laughs> jokes. Mr. Monday stream request at is on request at this time. Everyone, let out your wikes for the new Barbie stream. Why? I kid. Crosscode PLS. Why, yeah, 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 yeah. Crosscode? What is crosscode? Welcome, Tazen. <laughs> Happy Tuesday. How are you doing? Crosscode. Uh, I, it turns out I have this game. I don't know what that is. Let me take a quick look at it. Oh, 2D action RPG. Okay, it looks interesting. All right. Uh, yeah, uh, this I should play this soon. This is meant to be very good. Your son wants to play it. Well, uh, okay, so next week we are going to play Slay the Spire. And the week after we can play Crosscode. Thank you, Tazen, for the pick. Hope you're doing well. What about this Not clock? Necessary. I've got all the time I need. It's time for another brilliant maneuver, plus or minus 10 minutes. Yeah, Slay the Spire is amazing. The Swiss Freezer... Rover. Hello You're again. Ah, Rufus, how are you getting on? You're a bike? Is that a lurker? Yes. Thanks for the lurk, days and good luck with your chores. <laughs> Doing really well. <laughs> you are too tired. <laughs> I, I wouldn't have gotten it without the explanation. <laughs> That's really creative, though. the creator oh. <laughs> you're the chain of puns yeah <laughs> fire platypus is off the menu for now <laughs> call me an incurable animal lover weapons shop I seem to be stuck. I don't want to bother. Pump those rigs, get them like. <laughs> what am I saying? <laughs> Hello, Rufus is back. Darn it, they can't hear me. Okay, so they are uh, otherwise occupied. We need the invisible thing to get in here. Bucket with paint. Bucket with bait, not paint. Can we put something in this? I already hooked that. Why is there a why is that a hot spot? I already hooked I don't want that. That's really nothing like my epic. 
settle now without no backpedaling out of it now. Nah, it's really small bait. Ooh. Nothing like my epic whale bait. You, you guys made are from good. Phosphorescent anchovy. You guys are good. You who would just get lost. What if I wanted? I'm not buying that. You ain't. And you're obviously. What if I prove to you that <laughs> I like this? Well, you will. Fine. And now, shoot. How are we going to prove that we have the fisherman's luck? He wants his piece of oh. quiet. He can have it. Oh. Wait, what did I do? I put the expired pills in the bait. You who would just get What if I want to fish? Um, and you what? <laughs> well, you fine. And now shoot. I don't want that. Nah, nothing like Wait, let's leave and come back. Uh So that had no effect. I already hooked. I already what was it I didn't want to do again with- Oh yeah! Stick my head. Bucket with bait. I already hook- I already- Hmm. I don't know, I think that was a first step for some other thing. Yeah, <laughs> the deck is really funny. Over here. Gets tangled up in something. Okay, nothing immediately happened when we put it back. So I think this is the air platypus's place. That isn't the. No. Oh. Pharmacist. Can't do much with the pharmacists. So we didn't do much at the birdhouse. What if we put some bread here? Okay, that works. And what did that accomplish? Apparently nothing. And it's not a hot spot anymore. My botanical expertise tells me that this here is a a, a plant. Wow. So this guy isn't happy with us. And we took everything this guy has, so I think we are probably done here. Knock knock. Hmm. You again. You're such a pathetic wretch. But I'm rich in spirit. Isn't that the same? See you right. Leave me. Okay. Who looks so ferocious. But of course, it's Hoedown the Garden Gnome. Hoedown, Hoedown, ugly as can be. What was that? That was so random. <laughs> oh, that was so random. Maybe we need to make him happy somehow. He's got a rake, he's got leaves. He should be perfectly happy. Hey, hands off the tree! Okay. Uh, watcher? Watcher the plants? Hey! Oh. Hey! Oh. He's got a rake, he should... Shred of toilet paper. So this is like sandpaper. Where could we use that? Hey! Flowers. They're still weak. <laughs> That'll be the day. I don't want it to get. There's already enough lint. Lint. Weeds. You can't Weeds. even make a salad out of them. Not even if you like salad. Oh, you don't like salad? <laughs> okay, we are back here. Why can't we just cut this? With the sandpaper. <laughs> you can't take it or leave it. Catapult. I just... And then... <laughs> you gotta leave it first, then take it. 
<laughs> and <laughs> welcome for ha. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I don't want it to get us already. The flag o mat. <laughs> antenna. The flag o mat. <laughs> Where could we use the <laughs> antenna? And then. <laughs> And why would we use the antenna? So we did two things, no, none of which led to anything. We put the bread in the birdhouse, we put the expired pills in the baits. A full of dirt. Can we get more dirt? I've got enough loose dirt. If I need more soil, I Well, what happened to the buckets? Anyway, uh, greeting cards. Is this According this to the is the guy, air? This is by an expert like air nests. The other was the uh, water nests. <laughs> I've already solved it. You did. Up. We cannot take the crank back. Just a second. How can I help you? Uh, okay, we are done with this guy. I tried my best, old name. He just... Great service. He just wouldn't stand on the trapdoor. So what if we find that trapdoor stand on it? What exactly happens? Uh... Welcome a Grab a bus, platypus. Yes, I will, Ducky Bill. Your legs are short. Your nose is flat. I must... Okay. This hat looks like... Looks kind of like the juicer hat, doesn't it? A little bit. But we cannot pick it up. Keep it safe. Oh, I, f I feel stuck. You who? What? Wait a minute. What is that? Uh, uh... I would like to. That's good. That's very. What will it be? So from the free farm, it's prominently no, it's nice. Oh wait, so, it's nice. wait, wait, wait. <gasps> what if actually we can fool him, giving the toilet paper as if it's a coupon? Is this a prescription? May I touch? At least it seems to be written in braille. <laughs> the writing is a what? little smeared, but it isn't a prescription. Trying to use all the things with all the things. So the sure this time. <laughs> Apparently wait not. Though. This is one of my coupons. Where did you find it? <laughs> he was under his nose the whole time. With this, you get a free sample of we my We figured it out, Chaz. It wasn't sandpaper. Agnito, the cucumber of revelation. It's so new. I should have tried this before. I even went into the effects. toilet looking for cool. that coupon. So we have the cucumber of revelation. The cucumber of revelation. Hey, I think I actually just had an inspiration. You should never trust a blind man. Or he'll fob the worst crap off on you. I don't want it. There's already an. Let's see I if this can be used on everything. I bet that it's set. There's nothing it's about. There's no need. I want it for whatever. My thing, but it's not like. Quite cucumber like of a revelation. Re I don't need a revelation to crack this rotten cucumber. Wait, what am I doing? Huh. Not even a scratch. I probably need better tools. Oh, we are trying to open up this cucumber? <laughs> Shredder! You wouldn't consider that a fair puzzle. Who, who reads a rough piece of toilet paper and concludes a braille version of a coupon? S see, that is not what you should conclude that from. I, I even had the idea of going into the toilet to find the coupon, but we find something else in the toilet. So, that is clue enough. Or at least they expect that to be clue enough. It's very uh, kind of 
its own kind of logic. You know, what you might call moon logic, which I kind of disagree with. It's the Ponyo logic, right? But you go into the toilet, hoping to find the coupon. You find something else. You may as well try it as the coupon. If you if you think deeper into that, you may conclude that you may at least think that you may be able to fool the pharmacist with blinds. I would I don't really know. like, but not with. Uh, what a pity. But that's the law. Wait. I would, but not with. Uh, what a pity things. But that. okay. Cucumber revelation. We need better tools. Better tools. Like what? I already hooked. I already. Better tools like what? Um. What about this? I'll catch this. No. I don't see any tools. What about the electricity? Uh, let's try this as well. Black wood with and maybe no. maybe. Oh, what? black with and maybe. Oh, no way. Let's try the electricity. A little more power here. Don't if you want. Ground. No. I'd rather wait. It, they just. I'd rather wait until the last second for acts of desperation. It, they just. Okay. Uh, what if we can? If can we freeze it? I'll come back to it if I need a couple of items. I'll come back. Can we freeze something else? I know we did. I'll come back. We did a platypus here. Doc can just clean that up. Now, which platypus is brewed in frozen soil? Time to look it up in the field guide. It's oh, the earth. yeah. We did it. Well, that would be earth platypuses. Uh, who's supposed to remember all this nonsense? So I guess. The bucket is still in here, then. I'll come back to it if I... We can't open this drawer, can we? <coughs> it's okay. <coughs> it's okay. What if we give this to Doc? Maybe he has a way uh, of You must know all about psychoactive substances. Who told you that? Was it Doogie the dealer? Who? Exactly who? I don't even know him. And besides, he's lying. <laughs> so this is a psychotropic drug, then. Psychoactive substance. But we need to open it first. I have no idea. They're always the first thing to... I can barbecue later. On the glow. Hey, I should rem I'm gonna have to brew. It would be cool if you could get some weapons from this lady. Hello? Test it. Attention, a I repeat, a in order. <laughs> okay, so that's. Hmm. What if we give this to the fisherman? <laughs> Do you want to prove to me that you're a fisherman? Then show me something you've caught. Otherwise, shoot. Are we supposed to show him the razor fish once you we pick it up? <laughs> oh, what if we juice it? Can we juice it? Oh, cucumber of revelation, reveal your wisdom to me. I thought you weren't able to use stuff on stuff, though. The shop bought stopped us but i guess this is its intended functionality oh, so these indestructible sunglasses of eternal darkness are a total ripoff please explain the reason for your dissatisfaction well they're broken may i please have a look at the defective merchandise here 
just like I said. What a piece of junk. Those are only scratches. The glasses are completely functional. <laughs> See? As good as new. <laughs> I see. Ingenious. I just have to convince this tin can to wear the glasses. Oh. Then, um, whatever. Something really clever. Yeah, so he won't see us pick up the invisibility thing. Oh, so that was possibly, uh, it was possibly an optional puzzle to give us a clue on this puzzle. So we need to break this one part of the indestructible sunglasses. And then we have to give it to this guy. So he puts it on and we pick up this, right? Banana straightener. We never use that either. This device, which is already... But how do we break it? It's indestructible. It I mean, that just put us in the... In the same direction. We were already thinking about how to break this one. We, we saw how it was broken though, right? One of these lenses was completely, you know, the frames was completely broken. Excuse what I would X but I Or maybe I, you know. Maybe I don't break it. Maybe I try to give it to him without breaking it. Carl, these indestructible sunglasses of eternal darkness oh. are a total ripoff. Please explain the reason for your dissatisfaction. Well, they're broken. May I please have a look at the defective merchandise? I cannot detect any defect. The merchandise appears to be in perfect condition. Tch. Okay, we do need to break it. I am very sorry, sir. The destruction of sample items is not permitted. I'm not doing that because according to the label, yes, these sunglasses yes, are yes, 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 we did it. Is correct. We figured well it now. Done. Figured it out now. All right. All right. Oh, these indestructible sunglasses of eternal darkness are a total ripoff. Please explain the reason for your dissatisfaction. Well, they're broken. May I please have a look at the defective merchandise? Here, just like I said. What a piece of junk. Those are only scratches. The glasses are completely functional. See? As good as new. Stop acting cute. The glasses are broken. Excuse me. Where are you? I cannot see you at all. This indestructible high-end gadget is obstructing my view. What an overwhelming experience. Hello? Hello? Gah, that thing sure has some nerve. Hello? Uh -huh. Did you clear your throat? But you can't see what I'm doing. Or are the sunglasses broken? Certainly not. The sunglasses function perfectly. <laughs> Super. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> now that I have removed this fully functional item, may I politely inquire what you are doing over there? Well, I'm, I'm just uh, admiring your, your golden dragon of invisibility. It's really pretty. I hate you. <laughs> Okay, we actually got it. This is the stupidest thing. I love it though. Uh -huh. All right, all right. We got it. Wow, what a puzzle! I really loved that. You know, all I loved all the clues leading to that, the whole setup, the dialogue, uh, the humor behind it. it was It was an excellent puzzle. Excellent. Uh, so, okay, two things to try with the. Golden Dragon of Invisibility. Maybe we can put this on and try to pick the Razorfish. Huh? Where did my Golden Dragon of Invisibility go? I must have lost it somewhere. What? Ah. Oh. Are you serious? Is it back Ouch. there? Oh, ha! Oh! Huh. I must have tripped over something. Hey, that was the golden dragon of invisibility. So this is where I lost it. 
That was weird. Just an extra step to... Oh, I have to... Oh. It works! I'm invisible! <laughs> woo! Woo, 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 woo! <laughs> Ow! Can we pick it up Ow. now? Darn it! This isn't so easy when you can't see your hands. You can't pick it up? Oh, we picked that up. Yeah! Ouch! You couldn't see it, but I pulled off a really cool roll when I landed. Sure you did. Sure you did. Yeah! Ouch! I mean, wow! Unbelievable how elegantly I stuck the landing again. Good Ow. job. This isn't okay, we cannot pick that up. Uh, that's okay. Uh, let's leave. <laughs> I sure fooled you. <laughs> now we are completely... Ah, oh, okay. He took it off. Got the left frame, sunglasses lens, right frame. I knew I could break them. People just shouldn't challenge me. I knew I could break people. First, I should decide on which side to put the lens. I knew I people... I knew I people... Repair sunglasses, right I lens. Knew people How do we break Maybe again? I put it back. I better take okay, we can. Alright, uh, let me run the ads. And we are going to continue from here. If you're under the sub, you may get ads. Up to three minutes. Welcome here. Good Dissection to see you. Dissection time. Um, Veru yeah. Memo I'll just see you after the ads. Fire. Veru Memo just boosted water. How are you, Veru? Veru Memo just boosted three minutes, some call me. Oh, pretty low roll. That fire, wrath, and dark lens. Thank you for the boost, sphere. You've been booking movers, packings. Is it? Um... Oh yeah, you are. You are going soon. I forgot the date. Yeah, lots, lots of things to do. Right, moving is always a hassle. Little over a week. Now, now that you have. You you're here and talked about moving. That made me think about the wrath. So uh Wrath of the Rush is in the fifth place now. I don't think it's going to be in the next poll. But that that led me to think about the poll. And um if you look at how long to beat torment, it's about twenty six hours in length and fifty hours for hundred percent completion, kinda. According to how long to beat. Let's say 50 hours. That's like three weeks, right? Uh, chances are it's going to take shorter than that. So when do you think I should start the poll is where I'm trying to get at, actually. Maybe I should start the poll. Uh... <laughs> probably, yeah. Probably. Um, yeah, Wrath is not even in the equation right now. I don't think it will be in the poll. So do, do you think, because I think Arx Fatalis' poll was a little on the short side. I had planned for it to last longer, but then Arx Fatalis decided to end. Uh, so maybe I will, I will start at this a little earlier in case Torment does cause a surprise like that as well. Maybe we will start the next poll at the end of the Sunday stream. Torment is a short game, yes. Uh, but on stream, it won't be extremely short. So if I look at my Steam, I played Torment once and once only. But just one playthrough. So uh, I have 38 hours in it. My one playthrough of Torment of stream, you know, not really reading everything fully or paying it just extreme Undertale. attention. That was 38 hours. Zon just musted Chrono Trigger. Torment, yes. Just Watch on, my friends. Um, torments, torments. Okay. From the trigger and skull. Thank you for the boost as well, Paisen. And welcome back. 
But curse to boost games that last one tenth of the length of others. You're not saying that means you should get 10x the boosting power, but you're saying that. Oh, come on. You know, you, you are at least not boosting Diablo 1. What, what should parrots demand in that case? Look at this. Diablo 1. Seven hours. Seven hours. If you look at the boost by title. Diablo. Never mind. Uh, Diablo 1 has nothing to do with Parrot. Diablo 1 didn't even receive any boosts. Because at that point, we weren't. Uh, we weren't even boosting games. It wasn't in the system. It was just in the poll and got selected. But yeah, what about Diablo 2? Diablo 2 with 78 uh, boosts by Parrot. And Diablo 2 took a total of 17 hours. Returns is 20 hours. Really? Is it that short? Saga is less than that? Really? Oh, I didn't think those games were that short. It's kind of sad, actually. Welcome back, everybody, from the <clears throat> from the ads. <clears throat> so we have this this frame. <clears throat> huh? Where? Oh man, we cannot use this anywhere. Ouch! Oh! Huh. But here? Hey, so. I guess. I guess we can only use it where it's actually allowed. Oh, timer. Take might take longer because of reloads. Yeah, I guess so. It's It definitely might take longer. Okay, let's try it here. Huh? Where did? Oh, come on! Out! Oh. Huh? Just making a poor decision. Stop like himself in Saga. He has. I must have oh. tripped over something. Hey, that was the Golden Dragon of Invisibility. There's only so one save file. This is where I lost it. Is it like a roguelike? You cannot save the game and reload? Oh, that sucks. That's not my kind of game at all. I know the game is amazing. Hopefully it won't cause too many problems for me. <laughs> well, how did you lose it? You just took it off. Come on, dude. Out! Huh. I must have so this So maybe I need to put it put it in something so I don't lose it. It's already huh. I can it's already huh. it's already huh. I don't want it to get it's already unfortunately easy. According to the field hype uh, it's there's nothing it's a there's no need or whatever. My things are but it's not like why don't like or rat it should be uh, No no <laughs> Right frame See for defamation. It's already. Huh. I, it's already. Huh. There it is, the golden dragon. Of hey, Google, welcome. At least I assume so. Welcome, Google. Welcome, raiders. Thank you so much for the raid. How are you doing? How was your stream? Let's give you a shout out. Let's give you a shout out. Good to see you all. Might and Magic 3, such an amazing game. Ah! The warmth of life has entered my tomb. Ooh. Hey, smart man. Who wants to do it? It's a freaking shooter. Nice job, welcome. In. <laughs> You're afraid of okay. my shoulders because of the clips that might play? No, ah. Gucci. Everything is okay. Your clips are cool. We, we shot the fat lady. I'm not fat shaming, by the way. <laughs> Don't. Well, you get double shout outs. Gee. For that, you Don't. get double shout outs, cool. <laughs> if you wish, you can share the image or the video of the issue. How did the stream go? 
I'm not sure how you want me to do <laughs> No, that, you don't want it. Let me just... I can stop it if you want. Wait, take paper? I'm salty enough about this, okay. Oh, okay, I quickly need to take a screenshot. Okay. <laughs> Welcome, everybody. Thank you so much for the raid. That's very nice of you, Ghoul. How was your stream? How did Heroes go? That's not a good clip. I mean, maybe you can go and clean your clips if you don't like some of them. Some Sometimes I know um, people misclick and make accidental clips and such. Um, I, I just go back and clean it every once in a while. Heroes 3 is so hard. It is, it is. Yeah, I, I haven't really played too much of a single player. I played it a multiplayer mostly with people I know. And we would have our, our own rules which make it easier for us. I'm, I'm not really very good at the game. But it's an amazing game. I hope you've been having a good time with it. Definitely check out Ghoul, by the way. She plays all sorts of cool games. Some uh, really interesting, uh, creepy story games um, with interesting art. She has a nice taste and all, always plays some interesting content on her channel. Definitely check her out. And it's such a cozy and cool stream as well. Welcome, El Mundo de, de Hades. Imagine if shout out showed off one of the ones you clipped. Oh no, that's like a threatening, a very threatening situation. House rules, Heroes 3, so nostalgic. Yes. <laughs> hey, Satellite Go. Welcome, Satellite Go. Yeah, we did it like that. Like one of the rules, one of my favorite rules. Uh, that that we employed when when we played with Parrot was, uh, we would we would say that there is no attacking or taking each other's uh, resource nodes for let's say a year, or I don't know six months or so, and we would just frantically capture everything we could we could without touching each other, and uh, then build up huge armies, and. Um, collect all those armies into one hero and then have a huge clash in the middle of the map. I, I always loved those, those big armies with like hundreds of black dragons and stuff. It was so good. We also did the same in Heroes too. And then... oh, yeah. Stop <laughs> winning clips frantically, oh no. <laughs> well, if you are new here, I'm Mitral. I play a lot of points and click adventures and RPGs here. Uh, we are playing the second game in the Deponia series. Uh, we are trying to solve puzzles as we usually do. I hope you enjoy your time here and um, relax and have a good time. Again, thank you so much, Google, for the raid. And thank you, Raiders, for joining the raid. So we keep losing this golden dragon of invisibility. There it is. It's easy. I don't want it. There's our. Unfortunately, according. I bet I. Uh, it says. According, I bet I, but I, it says there is only, there's nothing about, it's about, there's no need for whatever, my things, but it's not quite a, like, or, did, it should this, be, this won't work. Excuse what I would like, not even if, it is, they are. Mm. So he doesn't let us do it here. <laughs> but we can leave with it, right? So I lost it again. Why do I keep losing it? Ouch! Oh. Huh. Maybe I'm mistaken. I must have... so... Maybe the game is doing this because it wants me to only be able to use this. Only be. Ah. Okay. So maybe I don't have to use the Golden Dragon of Invisibility anywhere else at all. I think this is because the game doesn't want me to use it anywhere else than here. So we need to find... I got it. We gotta put it on the periscope. It's gotta go into the periscope. So we don't know... Yes, it's a double lens periscope as well. So we gotta put this on it so that he doesn't see us coming. It has nothing to do with us being invisible. We just have to stop him from seeing us. I feel like everyone kind of owned the Ponya, never actually played it. The Ponya <laughs> is a very good game for those uh, who are interested well in points and click now. adventures. I think it's definitely worth playing. But the only reason I put it off for so long, like this is my first time playing, although I owned it for years. Uh, the main character, Rufus, is a very, very annoying character uh, with full disregard for other uh, characters' well-being and lives even. Uh, 
he's like the most uh, I don't know off-putting protagonist adventure game protagonist ever. So that was one Your reason which put me off for so perfectly. long. Thank you so much for the follow, by the way, Elvin. Though I appreciate it. <clears throat> but other than that, I think the puzzles in this one are excellent. It's just a very good point-and-click adventure. This character voiced by Tom Ska, or are you tripping? I don't know. I'm sorry. So let's see how this will work. Okay, the other one. Oh, right. It's you his, again. his I told left you eye. Ah, oh, darn it. I don't understand. Left eye. Pick it back up. Huh. The plan, but perhaps. Maybe I can. Put it in the left frame. <laughs> huh. Let's see how well he can see me now. There you go. Alright. New place. After a while. Door to the radio room. Well, looky here. If that isn't a radio station. What Maybe antenna here? goes somewhere Slides here. Of some sort. Probably the plans of unorganized crime. Let's see what those clowns are up to. Wait a minute. Nothing but scribbles. Somebody smeared finger paint on this. But that's... Hello? Wink, please come in. Uh-oh. There's a radio message coming in. Wink, answer me. Wait a minute. I know that voice. I bet it's Cowboy Dodo from the local radio station. Oh, it's better late than never. Are you going to but it's Cletus. Or not? This is Cletus. I mean, it must be Cletus. Of course, Bull's fiance. Well, ex fiance, actually. He appears to have survived the crash of the escape pod. But what has he got to do with unorganized crime? I better answer this. I'm great at imitating voices. He'll never catch on. Hello, Cletus. Wink. Is that you? Why are you talking so funny? I'm not talking funny. I sound exactly like Wink. A phonetically trained ear would hear that right away. Stop blabbering nonsense and get to the point. You know good and well that time is running out. Tell me, have you been able to track down my fiancé? Ex-fiancé, you mean? I mean goal, my fiancé. Wait, I've got the picture you wanted. You can print it as a slide. And here's a picture of the cartridge that holds the ascension codes. Ascension codes, uh-huh. That nincompoop is tough. He's not giving up. Excuse me? My income group's not enough for living it up. <laughs> that should be the least of your worries right now. Do you need any more materials? Where are you, anyway? Why do you want to know? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good question. <laughs> Why, I wonder. <laughs> Because of the handover later? My answer would have been more plausible, but yes, exactly. I'm in an Organon blast tower directly on the cruiser route to Porta Fisco. You'll find the coordinates on the next slide. But let me know in advance when you're going to show up here, or the Organon will see to it that your submersible never sees the surface again. Do you get that? Why do you need those ascension codes again? But I already told you! Yes, but your pronunciation leaves a lot to be desired. Ugh. I'll explain it to you just one more time. Ugh. The last high boat will be leaving Deponia from Port of Fisco in a week. So if I don't have the ascension codes by tomorrow, I won't be able to get back to Elysium in time! Now that would be a disaster. You said it. Actually, I shouldn't be telling you any of this, but I'm doing so anyway, because I know about the importance of motivating underlings. For reasons that are really none of your business, I must tell the Council of Elders in Elysium that Deponia is uninhabited. An awful lot depends on that. Everything else is insignificant. <laughs> right. Ulysses, the Organon's prime controller, takes no risks. 
If my report doesn't reach Elysium in time, he will see to it that Deponia is indeed uninhabited. Say what? I mean, uh, <coughs> what did you say? The Organon has the means to turn the entire area around the Rust Red Sea into a desert. So if I haven't got my anyway. hands on the Ascension Codes by tomorrow, mm -hmm. they will drop a bomb from this blast tower. As a result, all life on Deponia would probably be extinguished. This slide provides the proof. But then you would be dead, too. Oh, bravo. You're beginning to see why it's so important to me to get gold back. I hope you'll be sufficiently motivated now to find her. Please <laughs> us out. That's just, so cool just a for moment. people I, uh, 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 Oh, blast it. What do I do now? If Cletus doesn't get the Ascension Codes by tomorrow, then all life on Deponia will be eradicated. But if he does get them, all of Deponia will be destroyed. I have to beat him to it somehow. Looks like it all depends on how fast I can bring Goal around. In other words, on my charms. Heh, <laughs> can't <laughs> so hard then. <laughs> okay, have you got slides? If Cletus doesn't get the Ascension Codes by tomorrow, but if he does get I have to beat him to it. Huh? Yeah, we lost that item, that's fine. I don't want it, there's our... Yep. A let's say, let's use there's this. Nothing, it's a, there's no, no on everything. everything. <laughs> Just out of habit. It's, it's a move. Quite a like. Or my things, but it's not like. I don't think anything would come off then. No. Hello, Cletus. Rats. He isn't answering. Yeah, kinda, right? Oh, timer is not running. Oh, Jatlers, thank you for letting me know. Um, we are going to let it run throughout the breaks today. Like, I don't know. Or maybe I'll fix it after the stream. Button. What does this do? Ah, oh, kitty. Hey, kitty. Kitty. Oh, how cute. Hmm. Wait a minute. There's a little sign here. No dogs allowed. And underneath is a cute puppy who isn't a member of unorganized crime. Normally, I ignore any sort of warning sign. But hey, that puppy is really cute. And open Wait it. A minute. And under normal, but hey. What? Hey, dude, welcome. Oh, how cute. Happy Tuesday. How are you doing? Yeah, we're screwed. Wait, I'm confused. Why can't we get. Why can't we get here? Go, go, Rufus! Uh. Hello? Dabu, wabu, wabu. Okay, we cannot do anything here. We cannot do anything with the... With the kitty? Here, yummy din din. Strange, it's not even blinking. I couldn't even shave a hairless cat with that. So we need to shave that cat to join the unorganized crime faction. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, ki yummy din din. Strange, it's not even blinking. Um. Whatever may lie behind this door, I am ready for it. Dan, just open it. Wait a minute. No dogs allowed. And underneath is a cute puppy who isn't a member of unorganized crime. Normally, I ignore any sort of warning sign. But hey, that puppy is really cute. I don't understand his reasoning for not opening the curtains. Whatever may... Ah. You are ready? Whatever... Ah. Then just open it. Do it. Whatever may lie by. Antenna. Whatever my. And Kitty doesn't hear us for some reason. I couldn't even shake. I couldn't. I'm. I'm confused. But exactly, am I missing something else here? That must be one of those genuine tournament hands for professional rock, paper, scissors. I have got to get on board that submersible. Why don't bars like kind or rat? It's still good. 
Is the kitty actually there and can see us, or is it like a... Like a static picture? It's, just, it's not even blinking. But we gotta shave that cat to join their faction. And, and we gotta go through the curtain after that. Well, true, true. Kitty. Oh, here. Yo, strength. It's not even blink. It's not even blinking. I couldn't even. Sh I cannot go over there. I don't know. Well, we we solved this and we are stuck again. All pictures are static unless something else is applying a force onto them to move them. That's also correct, Daisy. Thanks for the clarifications, as usual. Okay, maybe... Maybe focus on something else. Um, I mean, there's nothing to, else to focus on. Maybe we can show the slides to Doc. We have a problem. Argus wants to depopulate Deponia if Cletus doesn't manage to reacquire the Ascension Codes. But if he gets them back, he'll blow up the whole planet. I said we have a problem. Hmm. We had best rely on the Tinkerer's method here. Yeah, we collect random objects and try combining everything with everything else. We there solve one problem after another. That's what I meant. So you you weren't helpful at all. Well, to... To convince baby, uh, baby goal, we need to join the resistance group. To join the resistance group, we need the tournament hand. To get the tournament hand, we need to join the underground, uh, unorganized resistance, uh, unorganized crime. And to join unorganized crime, we have to somehow shave that cat, right? That's where we are at. To convince the, the other goal, whatever was her name, the noble one. We need to take her out to a dinner, and to do that, we need to first get rid of all the platypus foods from the menu. Uh, one part involves somehow untying that knot that we weren't able to untie, and the other part involves uh, probably getting the razor fish and painting it to become a zebra fish. Now we are stuck in all three fonts. Can I show the slides to this guy, since he's a resistance? What is this? A challenge? Let me see. What's that supposed This isn't a... I never... Then why come back with... Okay. Hi-ho. Hi-ho. So I go with us looking at this Are you looking for trouble? <laughs> <That's> come <laughs> on. Sing along. <laughs> hey, dee 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 do Man, are you lucky I don't hit the handicap? I could use... I could use Kim with me. Excuse me? Mm. You were get Hey, do you- Sure. Unfortunately, I'll- I would really- Don't be re- Could you pop- I- I know you- What was that? Shave, Donna? No, no, no. That'd be extreme- Ha <laughs> ha! And s- hmm. Don't try to- I'll, I'll get back- what? Okay. Hey! It's the only thing that provides- Okay. Hi! Ah! You again! Are you finally gonna What else don't in that case a uh, downtown is reserved for smooth special however Platypus fights No, we already did it, right? We already did it. Uh spit him. That yeah. Go on. Platypus Bataka. Platypus but sounds exciting. Too bad I probably won't. I'd volunteer, but I can't pop. <laughs> That's right. You no, I mean I would when I'm conscious. Uh, exactly. A drink. Are you trying to get me? Would that help? <laughs> I can. So you might as well not, not even try. <laughs> A fellow who. Ah, uh, bummer. See, come back. Okay, let's change her.
Wait, actually, can we show her the slides? We need to hurry. The Organon is planning to depopulate the Rust Red Sea. Let him come! I'll tie their mechanical beards in knots. That'll teach them not to mess with me. Okay. Um... Hmm? Oh, you never realize just like living in <laughs> Okay. Wait is third. That it <laughs> What does this what does she say about this? We need to hurry. The or if that includes you, then I'll drink to them. Wow. Wow. Can we go back in here? No. I never again. Never never Hey Voxel again. Badger. <laughs> How are you doing, Happy Tuesday? Yeah, I, I think I'm starting to think this is our next is that supposed to be to order me, of business. Like but I don't know how how we will pick it up. Hey, hold still! Oh, darn it! Oh, it seems to have some sort of motion sensor. Motion sensor. I'll catch this fish with I I don't get what is stopping us. Maybe we have to break the generator again. Try to do it when it's offline. This isn't the trash. This isn't the I don't see a switch. Eh, no matter. Turn off! This generator is pretty careless or any random well meaning. This isn't the tr This isn't. Hey, it actually. It actually can work again. Oh man, it's this easy! I could have done it before when I first turned off the electricity. Ah, okay. It's just that something I missed in the past, then. Okay. Alright, we are back on track. For a moment, at least. Where's the dog's place? So, let's see if my guess was correct. Black would be better. With flames glued to the side up front. Now. And maybe, maybe, maybe that's an really high Voxel low Voxel Badger ones. just boosted no, Baldur's Gate 3. Not Voxel many. Badger just boosted Undertale. Black would with flames. And maybe, maybe. Okay, this was the wrong idea. According to the field, I bet. But it says that. I'm not even. My stuff. <laughs> that would be enough. Yep. I don't want. There's our. Acqui I bet. It's. There's nothing. It's a. There's no need. I or whatever. My thing. But it's not. Why don't like or it should be oh, oh I, I, I know what we are going to do with this we, we are going to do the other thing you need to get dinner good luck with the stream thank you girl enjoy your dinner have a good rest of your day it was a pleasure to see you as always okay let's show the fisherman look at this a fine specimen wouldn't you say what the don't tell me you caught that <laughs> sure looks like it. Holy heady. Perhaps I misjudged you. Just Great how is that just possible when Zoria. you have so little fisherman's luck? What's your secret, buddy? Draconic dude just boosted Solastock. I use a special kind of bait. Huh. And Draconic now he dude claims just boosted to have a small wood. Bait is important. And you must have caught that razorfish somehow. Could it be that you really got a special bait? Are you calling me a liar? Not if you show me your bait. Huh, what's in it for me? Well, I could offer you a tiger fish. An ordinary tiger fish against my fantastic special bait? You must be a few worms short of a can. Forget it then. Forget it then like so totally. Ha, see if I care. If you want a tiger fish at some point, bring me your special bait. If not, shoot. Special bait, okay. Here's your here's my special What's bait. What's that supposed to be? What do you think? My special bait, of course. Hmm. 
That really does look like genuine bait. All right, maybe you do know how to fish. You can take a tiger fish. Got it. Congratulations, Mr. Fisherman. Now give me the bait. Oh, I think I don't know. This is a pretty tiny fish. This is what the expired pills. All right, all right. Any fish was you up. motionless, right? Sleeping. So maybe if we hadn't put that, maybe we would be able to take the tiger fish. Okay, maybe we can paint the tiger fish now, though. Special bait <laughs> nick. Let's see if this works. Okay. Voila! Yes. A zebra fish. I had the correct idea, the wrong fish though. According to the field guide, water platypuses hatch their young in the mouths of living zebra fish. So far so good. Um, According to the field guide, now, I just have to Bring it back to life. Ah, oh, of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Ah, I could restore the poor fish to life <laughs> with a couple of targeted electric shocks. All those hours under Dr. Gizmo's defibrillator are finally paying off. Rufus, what are you doing out there? Stop that right now. The generator is beginning to overload. The energy flow is off the scale. Space is already beginning to bend. Just a second. Come on, fish birds. Live. Live. Oh, no. <laughs> I did it. It's alive. <laughs> Rufus, damn it. Yeah, okay. It's what alive. But now I should make sure that the fish gets into some water. Otherwise, it won't enjoy its existence as a zombie. <laughs> what about this? Hang on, Frankenfish. Hang on. Okay, not that water then. It's hey, alive. What's that twitching? Uh oh. It doesn't look like Frankenfish is doing too well. But now twice. I should make sure that the fish gets. All those sentences, okay. Okay, actually, there is water here, right? The twitching has stopped. Uh, that probably means I used to have a cool zombie pet. All right, we gotta... We gotta, um... Of course! Ha! Revive All it again. Rufus, what are you... Just... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Whatever. Actually, now, uh, otherwise. Let me. Let me make a save here. To get those dialogues without the sound effects, I will have to change the change the volume settings before ripping the sound. So let's have a backup save there. Is this acid or water? Do out. What? Is this a Do out. Is this acid? Do out. Hang on, friend. I have to take him someplace where he can brood in peace. It won't last long. Why fresh? Considering that crane, I thought he was. Hang on. Why isn't that working? Paint buckets. No, that should be. Otherwise, I'll wind. Hang on. I have to take it. Okay, it's not twitching. Hang on. I have to. Maybe I, I keep doing this. I have to take. I have to. Where is there water? I have to... I, I don't have to do it every scene. I guess hey. I... Uh-oh. But now I should... I can make it every two Hang scenes, on. right? 
cute. But I should hurry. I have to take him someplace where he can brood in peace. Brood in peace. Where? The tavern? Hey, uh-oh. But now I... Hang on. <laughs> but I should... I have to take... No, nothing here. I have... Need to get a bag of peas to put them in. Hang on. I have it needs to brood in peace, right? Rufus even tells you that. I don't know why I never thought of that before. That's extremely smart though. To the layman, this looks like the perfect platypus breeding ground. But the pro knows that the layman is an idiot who should go home <laughs> and collect postage stamps. Wow. Hang on. Oh, I got it! I got it! Hey, what's that? Uh-oh, but now I... I don't know why it took me so long. It's the... There is an aquarium. Hey, Rufus! Hey, Rufus! Hey, Rufus! Hey, Rufus! Hey, Don't try to stop me. I have Welcome, to save Ray. the life Good of a fish. Good to see you. Happy Tuesday. How are you doing? It was a brief but fulfilling existence. You worthless idiot! Remove that monster from my aquarium immediately! Come to Papa. All right. We got it. We got the water platypus. Which should go... What am I even doing? Let's go, my duck build friend. There's a nest to guard. <laughs> it's kind of cute. Water platypus seems to be no longer on the menu. All right, one. Ah, of course, we sold this too. Chats, we are suddenly. We are suddenly almost able to um, date with the lady. Uh, exactly. <laughs> My platypus catapult is loaded and ready for action. Well then. <laughs> okay. Whoa. A perfect trajectory! <laughs> Here, platy platy! <laughs> Stupid critter! Hmm. Put the vacuum cleaner. Here, pla Hmm. With this here, look at the yummies that Papa Rufus has. <laughs> Doesn't seem to be hungry. They eat dry bread. There's bread right here. Here, look at the. <laughs> Doesn't seem to be hungry. It's already now. I just. Yeah, it's hatched. I, I just. Here. Hmm. It should be possible to build a land. Mm, no, actually. Yes, of course. All that's missing is the right handle. It should what? be possible to build some a landing net for flying platypuses. Mm, no. Actually, yes, of course. All that's missing is the right handle. What? Is he being serious? Here, look at the. 
Huh. Here. Hmm. What am I trying Empty. to build? Did you see that string? Here, it was an empty sweaty. Hmm. Rufus thinks he's serious. Here. Hmm. What do we think? Here. Hmm. Okay, um. So far, so good. Now, all I have to do is catch it and bring it back to its nest. How do we catch it? You put bread here. And is that why he he's flying here? But how do we get it? All it lacks is the right handle. Handle is in It should be possible fully or a let I'm sure then I could all I need. Yep. I don't want it. There's already there's nothing it's about my thing, but it's not. It should be a cut. It should be a tool. Why does that all? So this is like a a bird perch, maybe. We just gotta install it somewhere. So platypus perch is there. But where? Where do we do it? I'm gonna have to brood on this. Up. Okay, you do that. Huh? There aren't a lucky me. I've already saw a noble animal. He goes right to the root of the problem, and if that goes wrong, he can always blow up all the platypus breeding grounds. Hmm. The tree? My stuff is filled. I don't need to. Hey, hands off the tree. Okay. He's got a rake. He should. Hmm. Okay, can we pick this back up? Huh, I'm sure that can be used a second time. It's can. It's can, okay. It should be possible to a landing net for mm, no. Actually. Yes, of course. Heh, <laughs> that looks just like the landing net from the picture in the field guide. It's a good thing I'm such a brilliant inventor. Otherwise okay. I would have had to practice trial and error forever. Yeah, I know, right? Landing nets. Here, plat. Ha! Got it. Okay, we got it. Let's go, my duck build friend. There's a nest to guard. <laughs> huh, it's kind of cute. Yeah. Why didn't it play? Flying platypus is off the menu for now. The command is a little different, maybe. Oh no, you're not the sub. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ray. I'm sorry. Someone else can use it for you, though. All right, so there is no more platypus. All the platypuses off the menu. Instead, they now oh, have hey! rats who play. <laughs> Maybe I'll keep that to myself. Um. All right, uh, now we can take out. Members only. Take her out for. Oh, pie. <laughs> Welcome, board game heaven just subbed. Bye, thank you so much for gifting us up to Ray. Very kind of you. Oh, I have to go to... Go to our dad first. Hey, dad. <sighs> What is it now? Can't you see your old man is busy? Mm. I 
did it. The menu at Shea Schlumpy is platypus free. Took you long enough. Had to go looking for platypus eggs first, did you? <laughs> Ha 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 ha. That's yeah, so funny. The very thought is absolutely hilarious. So will you let me reserve a table now? No. No! No! There's more to a date than fine food and a grand view, Rufus. No! As in, no? Yes. You also need to impress the lady with your manners. This is an Elysian we're talking about, right? I've got burns and blisters, two chillblains, and several platypus bites, and you say no? What about a poem? <sighs> Got burns and blisters, that's no lie. You still want more? Don't make me cry. Not for me, for the lady. Nah, somehow I can't imagine that poem would please her. I can see it now. The sunset is magically reflected in the champagne, making the sparkles light up her tresses of gold. It's more like orangey? Schlumpy is serving dessert, and then I recite the poem. You mean I recite the poem? Y yes, of course. You. Well, are you well versed in the lyrical arts? Sure. Well enough to tootle my own horn. No reason to worry. I happen to be a master poet. I just have to read through a few more volumes of poetry until I find the right verses. No, Dad. That'll take forever. Patience is the most prominent feature of a romantic, Rufus. No poem, no table. Got it? Mm hmm. He'd better think again. I've been listening to that doddering old fool long enough. I'm gonna solve this problem my own way, a la Rufus, with another truly brilliant move. I know which words I'll use to impress Goal. Don't make a fool of yourself. Too late. Okay. Your hair is like flowers, without the stalks. Uh, fallen angel, let's go for walks. Uh, you'd better let Daddy do this. A junk dealer from Porto Fisco once met a nice girl in a disco. He said, you have class. But she said, I'll pass. She thought it too much of a risco. Uh. You'd better let Daddy do this. Bad punzel, bad punzel, uh, ringle wrangle runzel. <clears throat> oh, that was terrible. You'd better let Daddy do this. Here am I. There are you, Platypoo. Uh, you'd better let Daddy do this. Wait, I remember that. I bet I can do this without your help. That's what you said back then when you were playing one. Blind Man's Bluff. It took you three days to find your way home. And two years until you had paid off what you owed me from the bet. Don't go forget not even Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. I've got an idea. I like your pretty face so well, and your sweet platypussy smell. <laughs> Let's see, did this change one of the selections? Hey, Disco. Dad. What is it now? Can't you see your... Okay. I don't... Too... Ah, oh, no. I... It took... And... Don't... For no. Not even... Hmm. Welcome. Grab... Yes. Okay. Into your eyes, I'm fondly gazing. You're not a platypus. <gasps> Amazing! This could be a poem. <laughs> Rosa, red, violets are blue. Which Rufus, I'm fed. Probably sorry. Your legs are short. Your nose is. F I like your pretty face so well. Into your eyes. I mean, that's a good poem. You're not a platypus amazing. Hey, Dad. <sighs> what is it? Can't you see? I haven't. Uh, what? Now, in. I don't. don't. Too. Okay. I played and don't forget. Um. Well, okay. Let. 
let's not try to oh wait but he has to let us reserve the seat so we have to convince our dad we cannot just go and invite go so where do we get where do we get a poem you -hoo. i would that's good that's very what will it Another cucumber. Sorry, no can do. For one thing, they are no longer grown because of certain incidents. Partial paralysis. All of my ways I've belong irritation. to you, that's perfect. Spontaneous gene mutations. Also, it's strictly one to a customer. Dang, it was really good, you know. <sighs> See you later. Okay. Let's see if Doc has a poem idea. Hello again. Ah, Rufus, how are you getting on? Okay. That kind of woman. You need to show her. There's no time to. We need to repair her. Uh. Mm. I'll... Not helpful. Any changes here? No. Can we like hear anything? Food. Enjoy your food, Tazen. Enjoy I your food. I don't want to bother the two. Wait. Hello? Darn it. Okay. They don't answer. Little Venice. Dark alley. Nope, nope, nope. You who again? Scram! Hey, I'm a fellow fisherman. Did you forget? Eh, so maybe you can fish, but you're still bad luck. Set us up too long. Yes. Fishing is fishing yeah, we ain't gonna break. You may back stay away Okay, Thor. Will you? Uh, but shoot. enjoy your break. I'll see you later. Enjoy your sleep. Somebody set us up the bomb. May I bother you? Aren't you gonna... <laughs> I'll be there. Okay. Excuse me. Mm, you would. I'll... I hope. Are you looking? Oh, come on. Sing along. ID. Manny. Huh. So that. I hope there's also some. Okay, let's let's try to talk to Gorn. Hmm. You never get realizing. Just like living in. Co <laughs> Could I interest you in a romantic dinner? A dinner invitation? Really? Huh? Maybe there is a spark of gallantry left under that filthy coat of yours. Dinner first. You can go looking for my gallantry later. Which restaurants do you have in mind? And is it clean? It's an excellent establishment. Reputable location, fantastic view, and the cuisine is exquisite. Exquisite cuisine? What are they serving? Mud roast? Well, it's most certainly not platypus. No platypus. You're quite sure. Oh, yes. They've got everything except for platypus. All right. Why not? At this point, everything sounds fine to me, just as long as it gets me out of this dive. Go ahead, then. Ask me out. While I'm waiting. Could I interest you in a romantic dinner? A dinner invitation? Really? Huh. Maybe... What? You can go look at... Which restaurant? Uh, it's... Rep and a what? Well, it's... Mm, your oh, yeah. All right. At this point... Go ahead, then. Ask me out. While I'm waiting. Hey, baby. Uh, there he goes again. I give. I'm a. F okay, we need. Wait, is we good. need That's the poem. <laughs> we need to figure out the poem first. Hi. Ah, are you? F See. Go if Cletus doesn't. How do we learn a poem? But if he does get them, I have to beat him.
We cannot talk to anybody. Oh, the poet! What? How did I not think of this before? There's a poet knock, right knock. here. Hmm, you again. You know quite a bit about poetry, don't you? I'd be a lousy poet if I didn't. Was that a yes or a no? Please don't tell me you need my help with a poem. I need your help with a poem. No. But it's for a lady, and, uh... Most importantly, it has to come from within you. Isn't it also important that it rhymes? You know, towards the end. Not necessarily. And the meter. What about that? No matter. As long as it comes from the heart. Just give it a try. Here am I, there are you, Platypoo. Say that again? Uh, here am I, there are you, Platypoo. You can't be serious. That is truly atrocious. <laughs> the very worst I've ever heard. I wasn't going to admit it, but you really need my help. Will you give me lessons or something like that? Heavens, no. I know a lost cause when I see one. There is only one thing that can possibly aid you. It's the oldest trick in the poet's book. Drugs? <sighs> Ghost writing. That's what I meant. Here, take this bug. What on earth for? Stick it in your ear. But it's still wiggling. Don't be such a sissy. Stick it in your ear. Then I can whisper the right words to you during your date. Cool. Like a secret agent. Okay, let's try. Actually, yeah, yeah, let's let's run the ads first, and we are going to. I think we are probably getting very close to solving this particular puzzle. But let's take a moment. Oh, I'm not going to stop the timer because I accidentally kept it off for too long earlier. We'll just gonna, you know, approximate it by keeping it running um, for two ad sessions or something. But yeah, I'm gonna see you in a few minutes. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. Do we have any boosts? Yes, we do. Water skates, Undertale. Don't forget to drink water. Zoria. Solasta. And Dink. Thank you for the boosts, Voxel and Draconic Dude. Thank you for the Hydrate Parrot. So we are going to take the lady goal out to dinner. There are still two fronts that we are stuck at. Um, convincing baby goal, which involves us joining the resistance, taking the tournament hand, and for that joining the underground um, unorganized crime. Which involves shaving the cats. I, I have absolutely no idea how any of that is going to happen. I don't understand the cat area. And um, what other thing were we stuck at? Were we stuck at anything else actually? No, just that. Just that. Just that one thing left. I think. Anyway, um, maybe something else will pop up. We shall see. So it looks like the next poll is going to consist of the third games in four different series. Mass Effect 3, Diablo 3, Fallout 3, and Baldur's Gate 3. What do you think we'll win? Any Eric guesses? Wise just boosted Diablo 3. Diablo 3.
Paradise just roosted sacred. I feel like it will either be Mass Effect 3 or Baldur's Gate 3. We'll see. Paradwise <laughs> just hosted Might and Magic 8, Day of the Destroyer. Thank you for the boost, Pat. Alright, let's go back to the game. Welcome back, everybody, from the ads. Hey, Dad. <sighs> what is it? Can't you... I know we don't... Ma Too late. I may not be good at waxing eloquent, but I've got this. What? Ear wax? A prompter. The poet will whisper the right words to me. That poor wretch who lives below me? <laughs> what could he possibly whisper to you? Must you really play the piano after midnight? Doesn't sound so romantic to me. But it doesn't matter. I found just the right poem. I'll do it my way. Oh, the kid wants to stand on his own two feet. Almost. As you like it. Why not? I am going to reserve that table. And you take this. What is it? It's the invitation for goal. According to all the rules of etiquette, when she reads this, she will most certainly show up for our date. My date, you mean? Uh, exactly. Uh, but first, let me give you a few more hints from father to son. Wow, that was pretty moving. He even let me borrow a suit. Maybe he's not such a bad guy after all. You got a suit? I can hardly wait to give this to Goal. Have you read it? What does it even say? Do you know? What have you got this time? Well, what do you think? This is an official invitation to a romantic dinner. Oh, really? Hmm. This invitation actually meets all the rules of etiquette. Bravo, Rufus. Apparently, I was completely wrong about you. Wait for me later in the old town, all right? I'm looking forward to being able to lay aside a few more prejudices against you and Deponia. Lay aside certainly sounds great. <laughs> oh, Rufus. Why don't you <laughs> Look at up? us. I might have guessed that Dad doesn't know the first thing about women. With his terrific tips, it's a miracle that I exist at all. Romance and flowers, my ass. I'm gonna let him have it. Dad? What's been going on here? Flowers? Champagne? That louse! If this is what it looks like, the old philanderer might as well ooh, start digging the grave for his burial at sea. Right. Okay. What's this? I need a radio. Why would the old fart need a radio? Unless... Oh, I don't believe it. First he steals my date, and then my brilliant idea with the prompter. That miserable old dirtbag. Hmm. That louse! Oh, I've rarely seen such ugly fish. Good thing they're so rare. Okay. All right. Uh, first things first. Crane. Crane. What is it? I found something. One last. No. Little! Don't say it! Memo! I need a... radio! Are you dictating these memos to him? Don't change the subject, just give me the radio! Why do you have to do this anyway? I won't say. Do I have to get a memo that says I need secrets? Oh, stock market news. Oh, come on, Crane. Okay. Hello? Dad? Rufus, is that you? Get off the line now. I'm waiting for a radio message from my bro- Just get off the line, okay? You're bothering me, just like you always did. Hello? Rufus, get off- I'm just- You're Okay. Just like you 
Um, I don't need any. Just as we need to bother him more. The chemistry between us was until that traitor came. I don't need any. Just as if. I don't need any. Just. I don't need. Just. I don't need any. Just. You need to put this somewhere where it I makes a lot of noise, right? I don't need any. Just. If that doesn't beat all. Stealing my date from right under my nose! Your own son! Uh, excuse me? You're Rufus's father? He seems to think that. But I'm not. That is totally... <laughs> oh. I took him in when I was still mayor of Kuvak. We found him in the garbage, kicking and screaming. He's a trash baby. That isn't true! <laughs> Examine wow. your feelings, Rufus. I am not your father. Now you tell me? Have you no decency? Oh, look who's talking. Oh, you don't understand. This guy has... Has what? Standing? Style. A clean suit. You see, unlike you, the captain knows how to treat a lady. But... You heard the lady. Do I really need to call an attendant and have you removed by force, kicking and screaming? Just like the trash baby that you are? Wow. I'll get you for this. Has the wind changed? Something smells a bit off. Just an insignificant little breeze, dear. That's all. I... I, uh, I... <laughs> all right, so I farted. But that doesn't make him better than me. I am so gonna rain on his parade. I will teach him a lesson so tough that it was dropped from the curriculum of the School of Hard Knocks. Okay. Could we do this? Better not. It's enough that one goal has been taken in ah, by that okay. miserable fraud. What if... Huh, there aren't any greeting cards on the subject. Lucky me. Ah. Uh. Your legs are short. Hey, psst. You know about poetry, right? Sure thing. One of my platypus poems even made it to page three of the Platypus Daily. I see I've come to the right place. Here. Watch this. Radio? Oh yeah, you'll need it. It's uh, a romantic matter. Platypus romance or human romance? It's starting. I have prepared something very special for you. The icing on the cake. A poem in your honor. Okay, here we go. The poem. Pardon me? <clears throat> the poem. <clears throat> Go ahead. That was your cue. Oh, oh, I've got just the thing. Give it your all. I should be conversion. You are cuter than a batty You look just like a platypus. Uh oh. Ah! Oh, yuck. What? Hey! What the? Wait! You were right, Rufus. Seagull is an idiot. It was very noble of you to try and warn me about him. Thank you. He's disgusting. Rufus. Your foster father may act all sophisticated, but in reality, he is nothing but a subilluminated cerebral pygmy. Yeah, just without the stripes. Now all I have to do is persuade your last alter ego. To tell you the truth, I liked you right from the start. You are a lot like Cletus, but you have a real backbone, and you aren't such a sissy. That's true. Oh, but don't tell him I said that. I had better stay here until you manage to persuade the other two. I must admit that I'm actually a little jealous. Totally weird, isn't it? Okay. Okay, and so... We only have the baby girl to go. And I don't know how to proceed with this. Oopsie! I must hey, Tony. Off for a it's Sony. Was the epic adventure no game? No problem. Girl, as long as you didn't <laughs> have any direct skin <laughs> oh, no. with the bar, You then. caught that, <laughs> did you? You're funny. Welcome, Tony. It's so good to see you. Happy Tuesday. Yeah, I think we are doing fine. Uh, we've been solving puzzles. It takes a while. They are very complicated. Some moon logicy. 
They're very involved, lots of steps in each of them. You know, this is not an easy point and click, I must say. And uh, yeah, I feel like I'm stuck at every step of the way, but then we come up with something. How have you been doing? How are you? How was your Tuesday? You also need to play this game someday. Yeah, I, I think it's it's a great game. You definitely should play it. Okay, you know what? The Razorfish may come in handy with this puzzle again. So maybe Razorfish was stopping us in uh, three different puzzles. Let's see. <laughs> Shaving the house cat of a criminal syndicate would be really extreme. So extreme that they would be guaranteed to make me an honorary member. Well, Just get on from let's her. Do it. Welcome on. Huh? Oh, what? what's this? This is stuffed. Then where's the real kitty? Ah, oh, well, who cares? How you doing? How you doing? Uh oh. Ooh. Kitty wasn't a cute kitty. What have you done? Did we do it though? The boss really isn't gonna like that. We'll see. Boss! Boss! Here comes the boss. How's my hair? <laughs> what a question. Perfect as always. What? <laughs> Who? What's all this about? I mean, where's the boss? Somewhere behind this mad woman? <laughs> I caught an intruder. Oops! Aw, uh, poor kitty. Good kitty. Kitty, 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 kitty. This little dipshit shaved kitty. What do you want us to do with him? <laughs> My thoughts exactly. But she's only twitching. Th this lady suffers from ticks. <laughs> Well done. Now you've really ticked her off. So, any last words? Well, what did she say? Isn't that obvious? That I'm being pardoned? <laughs> what, I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> Got me there. What are your plans for me, anyway? <laughs> <laughs> Right. Will you please tell me now what that winking means? <laughs> Guess. That I'll be made into shark food? <laughs> Bravo, you guessed it. Yippee! Oh. Mercy! <laughs> Donna says no. Okay, so that means no. Mercy! <laughs> <laughs> right. Mercy! <laughs> what, I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> Got me there. What? Mercy! <laughs> oh, she <laughs> does them right. in an order. Okay. She does it in a certain order. Mercy! <laughs> what, I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> Got me there. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Mercy! <laughs> <laughs> right. Will you please tell me now what that winking means? <laughs> Guess. That I'm being pardoned? <laughs> what? I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> okay, that doesn't work. Got me there. That doesn't work. Uh, because she says no right after that. We gotta use. Wait. Mercy! <laughs> <laughs> right. Let's try this. I wanna make Donna an offer. <laughs> All right. Donna's listening. So the next is no.
The next is no. Forget it. I refuse to negotiate with criminals. Have it your way. Since the next is no. Mercy! <laughs> Donna says no. Alright, let's. What are your plans for me anyway? What about this now? <laughs> right. No, wait. Ah, uh, that didn't work. Now, the next is yes. But he will say, are you serious? And she will say no. Will you please but tell me now the next what is that yes? winking means? <laughs> yes. Wait, then. This won't work. I retract. Eve. Mercy! <laughs> what? I mean, are you serious? <laughs> is this next is no? No, she used the no. Okay. Mercy! <laughs> I have enough. <laughs> Alright. Okay. The next is no. Forget, I forget have it. it. Um, now the next will be no. Go ahead. A quick and painful death is better than having to endure this farce any longer. <laughs> Donna says no. What? I'm being pardoned? Are you serious? <laughs> now you have me confused. Are you being serious or not? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah, but I can hardly. This was a very cool apparent. puzzle as well. That means that you are now one of us. Congratulations. Very nice. Uh, Rufus. Rufus. Right. There's not many that make it. Two so far. How did that happen? Okay. Wait a minute. One of us. Hey, Donna. Any jobs for me? <laughs> well, I'm afraid it'll have to wait. I have my own mission. Okay. Yo ho, yo ho. Unorganized criminals, yo ho. Alright. Let's, let's pick this up. I really Finally, like that puzzle. My own tournament hand. Let's get out of here. That's just coming on the exactly. On guard! What is this? A challenge? Let me see. Yeah, those are actually real tournament fingers. And they're not loaded. So, let's get started. Are you ready to play rock, paper, scissors? What's the stake, anyway? The winner gets <laughs> to pick two fingers from the loser's hand. What? We play for fingers. What else? First person who has no fingers left to surrender after a lost round loses the game. So, how exactly does this work? The rules are quite complex, I must admit. But you really only need to remember three things. Scissors beats paper. Paper beats rock. And rock beats scissors. We only play with real tournament fingers. Any attempt to play with loaded fingers automatically counts as a lost round. <laughs> got it. Okay, let's try. I'm ready. Well then, lift your hand. One, two, three. Rats, it's stuck. What? No, we can't. What? Oh, that should be enough. Wait, what is this? Those are loaded. Any attempt to cheat counts as a lost round, so you need to surrender two fingers. What? So what did you think this was about? Get on with it. Put your hand on the table. He didn't stand a chance. I told you so. Want to play again? You lost two fingers. No, we. C Darn it! You're a fast learner. Looks like I'll have to open a new bag of tricks to win. So the only thing I can do is scissors, right? With two fingers. Rats uh, for a big so 
No fingers would be rock. All four fingers would be paper. Wait, what is this? Any attempt to cheat counts as a lost round. So you need to... Okay. What the... You win. Even though these are my lucky fingers. Oh, All right. Well, it ain't over as long as I have some fingers left. There. You won't pull that one again. You ready for the showdown? All right, now we can add fingers. Hmm. Using scissors what again. The? You win. Even though these are my lucky fingers. Oh, well. It ain't over as long as I have some fingers left. There. You won't pull that one again. You're now we can showdown. We can use paper too. He keeps using scissors. What's that? Rock. You're trying to be clever now. Just you wait. He only has two. So he can either use okay. I think he is going to use rock. No, I think he's going to use scissors again, actually. The thing is, he cannot use hands, right? Because he only has two fingers. So we can, at worst, tie. What's that? Rock! You're trying to be clever now. Just you wait. He only used scissors. Is this random, or...? Does he only use scissors? Ah! Darn it, you're a f Looks like I'll have to open it. Of course. <laughs> he doesn't have any fingers. He has to use a rock. Impossible. You... You... Beat me! <laughs> what what the heck was this? <laughs> Don't mess with Rufus! Rock and roll. That's what I keep saying. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Looks like I underestimated you. Well, be that as it may, I'm an honest player. And I keep my word. This is our secret knock. Can you remember that? Yeah, I'm not so sure. Can I hear it again? Uh, but you mustn't tell anybody else. <laughs> Nobody but go. What was that? I need some alcohol now. Ah, me too. Okay. Let's see if he can actually go in there without goal. I'd like to try and see that. Ah, Garlic. Did you get us that new recruit? Uh, it's slightly sure. different. Finally, a new face after all these years. Terminator theme You're would be ta 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 ta. This Nobody's is ta 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 ta. Just let me in, okay? Uh, let's see. <laughs> I should go tell Baby Goal that we're resistance fighters okay. now. Boy, I will she her. flip out. <laughs> Oh, it's you! How nice! It is done. We are resistance fighters. Really? Sure. I even know the secret knock. Wow. Then what are we waiting for? We have to go to Janosch and get our instructions. Last one, there's a rotten egg. Do you even know where to go? But no, no, hey, hey, stop! Oh, rats. Why did you wait that long to tell her to stop, though? Hmm, that could be right. <laughs> finally. But I'm not sure. I can never remember the new knot. Could you knock the old one again, just to be sure? But... That's pure harassment. If you're one of us, then you ought to know it. And this is better not be a knock-knock joke. Hmm. With my superb memory, 
I actually tut, tut, ought to tut, remember tut, tut, how it goes. That's actual determinator. You did knock it once before. All right. Weren't you gonna knock? I am. No, wait. Wrong again. Too bad. Better luck next time. Ow! Oh, I can't believe this. What about it? No, wait. Wrong better. Okay. Weren't you gonna knock? <laughs> Hey, that's enough. I'm coming out now. I don't see the humor in knock knock jokes. Huh? There's nobody here, so it wasn't a knock knock joke after all. That isn't the new knock, Lebo. Yeah, I forgot it again. Can I just use the old one? Oh, yes, okay, but only because it's you. Now I've got it. Okay. Hey, that was right. Of course it was. Well then, what are you waiting for? Come on in. The door's open. The door is what? <laughs> uh uh sure. What was that? Is a new recruit to at last. Our course is getting the attention the it prompts deserves are. and a smattering of respect. Say what? What are you getting at? Attention <laughs> and a smattering of respect. <laughs> hmm. Just listen to you kickle. <laughs> stop it! No, wait! Don't stop! How can I stop if you never tell me what it is that defines you exceeding the humorous? <laughs> Bravo! Awesome! But <laughs> Seriously, what place is this? Some kind of circus? Because, you know, I'm really looking for the hideout of the Resistance, not a carnival. You have come to the right place. True. Carnival was last week. Maybe the prompt was, do you want to turn the music on high? Because suddenly it's very high. That's supposed to be a plan? <laughs> All I can do is laugh in disdain. They haven't even drawn in a giant eagle to rescue them from an exploding high-rise at the last second. You're right. The stage is set, the show can begin. Now we have slides, right? Hey! What is that all about? You want to stop the Organon? I'm all for it. But you're going to need the right leader. Someone who's got courage and charisma. Shake, shake. With clear elocution. Shake. In short, someone who can go up against the Organon all by himself if need be. <gasps> Cowboy Dodo from the local radio station is charismatic enough. I was talking about myself, you dodos. Don't make me laugh. What could possibly qualify you for that kind of responsibility? What do you think? I've got a concept. I have got to concept myself. Oh, do you now? So, what's your concept? We're sitting here discussing, snacking on ships, and questioning about the unfairness of being oppressed by the Organon. And what exactly are you hoping to move that way? Move? Who said uh, anything about move? Sure, Pi. Well, isn't that sort of implied by the I'd term like underground know. movement? Oh, that, yes. Well, of course we are moving, as well. <laughs> I wasn't talking about circling the sun and drifting away from the other tectonic plates. Oh, hmm. Get real. Your concept is crap. For crying out loud, you can't even pronounce the word concept properly. I'm taking matters into my own hands now. Yes, oh yes, a slideshow. I bet this is going to be so exciting. Ah, really? Watch and learn. Okay. Oh, what is that? A spot? Impossible to recognize anything.
a symbol. A shimbo? How mysterious. The concept sounds pretty exciting already. Positively mystic, with just a hint of legend. Shut up, Leibold. And what does it symbolize? It shows what will become of us if we don't act right away. Oh, you are serious? I thought you were this joking. This is shocking. You're a pretty glib talker. But do you have any proof for your claim? I most certainly do. Oh, interesting. Here. What's that? This is an Organon Blast Tower. The Dark Exchequer has but distributed these enabled, towers was just around the planet. I find that disturbing. I'm scared. I don't quite understand. Why would the Organon build towers like that? What's the purpose of those bases? Our enemy will try to make the planet explode. What? But are you really sure? Of course. It's true. The order comes from the Elysian Council of Elders. They have no idea that Deponia is inhabited. Inconceivable. But what are we going to do about it? The resistance has to start an offensive. Attack the Organon. Are you out of your mind? We don't even know where to strike. To yes, we do. That's very, very weird. That in-game music setting affects an in-game puzzle. Hit them in the Organons. Yes. I am in possession of secret knowledge about the exact position of one of these towers. Wow. He seems to be really well prepared. I thought there were hundreds of blast towers. Why should we tackle this particular one? Our enemy might... Explode a bomb here and thus make the area around the Rust Red Sea uninhabitable. That's horrible. Rufus is right. We must prevent it at all costs. But what comes next? What about all the other blast towers? The secret knowledge in Gold's mind might represent a valuable advantage. So far, I understand it all. Can you give us a brief summary? I will do that. Uh, no, no, you don't have to do that, Janosch. I, I, I can do it myself. No, no, I will summarize this. Uh-oh. All right, whatever happens, don't laugh, Rufus. Show the first slide again, will you? Exactly. W what was that exactly? An Organon Blast Tower. <laughs> okay. okay. I think I understand. Oh, my belly hurts. <laughs> I think I understand. Okay. <laughs> He's done it again. What a jerk. Oh, just when it was getting really exciting. I am disgusted. So, Get uh, lost, you scoundrel. <laughs> the guy changes S's into the sh sound, right? Oh, so man. we have to choose words <laughs> that don't have... That don't have words like that. That don't have words with S. Like, no blasts. Something else. Uh, Let's let's see. Let's look at the options again. Hey, I thought we we've got no. Oh come on, water. No hard feelings, okay? I mean, I bet Janosch doesn't carry a grudge, and I'm sure he'll give me another chance to present my concept. After all, it could instantly make your organization the spearhead of worldwide resistance. I thought we already were the spearhead. Spearhead. <laughs> Rufus, get your act together or you're out. Sorry, of course. I, I, I'm not laughing. I'm completely serious. If you say so, what is this shot then? Okay. Mistake, shimble, schmuck, schlong, spot. Let's go with symbol. It worked last time. A symbol? A shimble? How mysterious. The concept sounds pretty exciting already. 
positively mystic with just a hint of legend. Shut up, Leibold. And what does it symbolize? It shows what will become of us if we don't act right away. Wow, this is shocking. You're a pretty glib talker. But do you have any proof for your claim? I most certainly do. Here. What? So, flash tower. Organon bombing fort. Organon bombardment base. Shelling post. Something like that. I don't know. Uh, Organon bombing fort doesn't have any S's. Let's go with that. An Organon bombing fort. Uh huh. Go on. Smashed globe. Destroy the world. Eradicate the Ponya. Our enemy will try to eradicate the Ponya. Okay, this Our could enemy work. will try to eradicate the Ponya. Yeah, okay, but what are we gonna do to prevent it? You got to attack them. Our troops will need to strike first. Our team will dare to attack. The resistance has to start an offense. Okay, we are. Our team will dare to attack. You got to attack them. Our team will dare to attack. Do we know? And where would that be? Secret knowledge, so skip that. Basis, maybe. Topographical data locating one particular or organ on fort. Yes. I obtained topographical data locating one particular organ on fort. I remember. Keep talking. Our enemy might drop a bomb here, dash, kill off everything that lives by the water. Detonate a bomb here, put an end to all life, marine and on land. This looks like it works. Blow up a bomb here, dust, destroy, destroy, okay. Put a bomb here, then see around, ru rushed red she. Okay, detonate a bomb here and put an end to all life, marine and on land. Detonate a bomb here and put an end to all life, marine and on land. But what shall we do about the other blast towers? Uh, ascension, short data, goal in our brain implants might mean a very important trump in our hand. She could know, okay. Goal and her brain implant might mean an important trump in our hand. So far, I understand it all. Can you give us a brief summary? I will do that. Uh, no, no, you don't have to do that, Janosch. I, I, I can do it myself. No, no, I will summarize this. Uh-oh. All right, whatever happens, don't laugh, Rufus. Show the first slide again, will you? Exactly. What was that exactly? An Organon bombing fort. Our enemy will try to eradicate Deponia. Our team will dare to attack. So far, so good. And what is this? You obtain topographical data, locating one particular organ on fort. Our enemy might detonate a bomb here and put an end to all life, marine and on land. Almost done. Goal in her brain implant might mean an important trump in our hand. You've understood everything. Bravo. That's all very well. But how does it help us? An Elysian inspector named Cletus is currently here on Deponia. Goal accompanied him. That's why she's here in the first place. Her codes serve to activate the last high boat in Port of Fisco that is supposed to take her back to Elysium. We have to let Elysium know that Deponia is actually inhabited. Therefore, I will take Goal to Elysium. But of course, you could try to sway the Council of Elders. Once they learn that Deponia is inhabited, they'll cancel the blast. But why should you of all people go to Elysium? Because I'm the spitting image of the inspector. <laughs> That's highly unlikely. But it's true. Rufus and Cletus could be twins. What a strange coincidence. And it gets even better. Argus's cruiser has docked at the blast tower I indicated. Its mission is to take Cletus and Goal to the high boat in Porta Fisco. During the attack, Goal and I can make use of the ensuing chaos to overwhelm Cletus, and then I will take his place. What do you say? Are you with me? That sounds very risky. But it's our only chance. Any more questions? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Get going. Wow.
Long live Rufus, our spearhead. Rufus. Oi! Yay! <laughs> that was so cool. You made Janos look like a little idiot. <laughs> well, how else would he look compared to somebody my size? So, what happens next? Oh, well, since you seem to be at one with yourself once again, I suppose we could go ahead with the surgery. It's a pity in a way. I feel oddly light-hearted with my noble and my sportive traits. Ah, I could get used to the thought of dating three goals. <laughs> Rufus, really? What? It's just that I like every aspect of you, baby. Oh, you said that so well. Can you please hand me the cartridges? I do miss the other two. I'll see you soon in Doc's lab. Don't be long. All right. She's into me! What's going on here? Janosch? I must listen and find out what is going on in there. Why? What is it that's going on in there? I mean, and what are you doing here anyway? We are putting your concept into practice. What do you think? My concept? Yes, you were completely right, of course. You cannot start a revolution by just sitting around doing nothing. Therefore, we are going to actively snatch the cartridges. Whoa, wait a minute. Those cartridges contain the mind of my girlfriend. Girlfriend? In your dreams, first off, go list a functionary of the resistance. So, of course, she's going to sacrifice herself for the good cause. Sacrifice? Are you totally out of your mind? Unfortunately, another organization has become aware of the Ascension Codex, or could I say, an organization. What? Do you mean Donna? Precisely. The unorganized crime has held up in Doc's lab. They took Doc and Girl hostage and are trying to extort a free passage. But the revolution doesn't take kindly to extortion. As soon as the clock strikes the full hour, we will system the premises. Actually, Girl left us disturbing. Libo and I will hold this position. What? But that's completely insane. Um, so it is. I know these people. They'll stop at Nothing! You're just gonna get yourselves killed! Or me, as it is! Judge is the fate of a freedom fighter, always ready to die for the good cause. Please, don't act just yet. Maybe I can think of something. Alright. Oh! Oh! We lost every item. So this is like a new section here. Let's get a save. What will you do? What else? I'm going in there now. But the place is crawling with unorganized criminals. I can handle them. Hey, open up. It's me, Rufus. Yes? Uh, Yoo-hoo, <laughs> can I come in for a moment? That won't work. You can use the portal soon. But first, you have to do something for me. Here. What's this? Another remote? Yes. It's Liebold's. It seems to be an older model, but hey, I know how to use a remote. Yeah, <laughs> of course you do. Liebold is the fat one, right? I'm only asking because I haven't seen an implant. You can do it. When you're finished, you can use the portal. Then I'll explain everything. Huh? What portal? Trust me, and not a word to Janosch. What was that? Okay. Huh, I wonder what all these buttons do. Ah, I'll just push the biggest one. And zap! You think it oh, was the future? Look ones? at me. I completed an important mission. Yeah, any monkey could have done that. This sucks. What the? Ooh. Oh, you were right. There you are at last. What took you so long? Just because you're from the past doesn't mean there's no need to hurry. Huh? What's going on here? Is that you, Cletus? Don't be silly. I'm your future self, of course. These portals are space-time curvatures. And this is the future. Da, 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 da. They, they call, call him Rufus. Rufus. <laughs> hey, that's my jingle. 
Not anymore. I'm more up-to-date, wiser, and way cooler than you. Is that so? But I look much younger than you do. What? You rotten baby face. Oh, I would love to give you the spanking you deserve, but I guess I can't because I'm already too senile for that. <laughs> Man, you're such a wimp. There's no way you can be me from the future. Jaw. I only said that in order to prevent a time paradox. Anybody could say that. You just don't know the first thing about time travel. Yes, I do. No, you don't. But I'm not as ugly as you are. Not true. Not true. You're even uglier than me. So there. Ha! You just gave yourself away. I know I would have thought of a much cooler reply. I actually did. I only said that in order to prevent a time paradox. Oh, yeah, right. You just don't know the first thing about time travel. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Okay. Future self. What a load of bull. You don't get it, do you? Was I really that dense back then? You might as well give up, Cletus. I'm not Cletus. I come from the future, you, you absolute model. You're calling me an absolute model? Yup, because that's what you are. A stupid, retarded, absolute model. Huh, I want proof. All right. Anything to make you shut up. A simple test will show that you're nothing but a puffed up loudmouth. Or you, exactly. So, what am I thinking of right now? <laughs> what? No, no, wait, wait. I remember now. You're thinking of Zeeble Zooble. Ha! Missed it by a mile, you clown. Zeeble Zooble. <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. You're an imposter. I knew that right away. No, I'm not. I had to say that so I wouldn't create a time paradox. Yeah, yeah right. Just admit that I won. Why? Why? What were you thinking of if it wasn't Zeeble Zooble? Well, actually, it was... Uh, <clears throat> hey, <laughs> future me, old pal, there you are. How's that for what? a surprise? I told you so. Can we finally get going now? You need to go in what? there and rescue Gold. So she's really in there? Is she all right? Don't panic. Very thinking Zeeble Zooble. Nod have been put out of action. What? You overwhelmed them both all by yourself? That was nothing. Looks like you're really me after all. How did you pull that off? Ah, you'll, you'll soon figure it out yourself. Meanwhile, I'm going to take care of the rebels. Whoa, is that really a gun? No, it's a banana peeler. Of course it's a gun. Can I try it? Not now. You're headed to the lab. You need to free goal, remember? But I want that gun! No, uh, oh, can we fast forward this bit? We can't do that! When I was you, I also didn't get the gun until later. <laughs> we need to do everything just the same way as before. I don't care, I want the gun! Why won't you get it? If I let you have the gun now, it would alter the timeline. I would dissolve, and we would have to start over from the beginning! Well, stop being so selfish and give me that gun, will ya? If anyone is selfish here, it's you! Or have you rescued Goal already? If I had a gun, I'd do it in a jiffy. Well, I did it with my bare hands! If I don't get my gun right now, nothing's gonna happen here at all! You can have it as soon as Goal is free. Okay. But why don't you go rescue Goal, and I take care of the rebels? Just, just trust me. You already did it earlier. So if you had done it right away, it would already have happened again over there. Oh, uh, yeah. It's totally logical. I grasped it the first time. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. Sure, me too. Yeah, you know what? Why don't you simply do it yourself? Because I need to hold the fort here. And why can't I hold the fort? Because I got the gun. Okay. Oh, well, I'll go rescue Gold then. I'm sure I'll do it way cooler than you did, and she'll end up being much freer than she did with <laughs> you. Please do it just as cool as I did, or I'm going to dissolve. And that is really painful, you know? <laughs> Me like. Rufus! Yeah, yeah, I know. Spoil sport. But afterwards, I'll get the gun, right? Yes, sure! <clears throat> through the portal. Yeah, okay. And hurry, the clock's about to strike the hour here, and then the rebels will storm the office. Blah, blah, blah. Kill, what an idiot. 
Doc! Cole! You're alive! What's going on? Rufus? What are you doing? Uh, just chilling. Killing? Bite out his eyes! That might not be necessary this time, boss. It's Rufus. He's Rufus one of us. What were you doing in Doc's asbestos cabinet? I, uh... Uh, needed some asbestos and uh, accidentally got myself locked up. Really? You gotta be careful. I lost two ants that way. But I'm glad you're here. We're trapped here. Some weird extremists are after our ascension codes. Your ascension codes? We were just about to add them to our corporate inventory. That's why we have this crowbar. If they don't leave soon, we'll be forced to shoot our way out. Shoot them all! Tabula Raza! Wait! I've got a plan. Get on with it then. Wink's trigger finger is getting all itchy. Blasted nickel allergy. <laughs> okay, can we open this now? May I? <clears throat> Super. Two more remotes. Great. That should get things moving. Let's see. There's a label on the bottom of one. Hey, it says Donna. Yeah. Oh, wow. So Donna has a brain implant, too. That should be useful. And on the other... Ha! Well, hello. This is the remote that future Rufus gave me earlier. The ah. one that belongs to Liebold. Obviously, I have a plan. I just don't know what it is yet. All right. Rats. It didn't work. That must be because there was no cartridge in the remote. Hmm. Oh, wow. So Donna has a brain implant, too. That should be useful. Oh, that should be useful. There's no Rat, cartridge. Okay, uh, what else is there? Go. Rufus. At last, you've got to get us out of here. I'm working on it. Work faster then. After all, you're the one who got me into this mess. <sighs> so you're Lady Goal. And you are about to become Lady Rufus if you don't hurry up. I found this remote. I think it belongs to Donna. What are you getting at? Well, if you would let me remove your cartridge for just a moment. Don't you dare. Come on. Please, give me that cartridge. Keep, keep your dirty digits away from my implant. Haven't you messed with my mind enough today? <laughs> Can't get me out of your head, huh? Ugh. What happened exactly? They were just suddenly there. Doc Is a crowbar to a bar for crows like a or a gentleman. bar made of crows? A futile attempt. There were three of them. They were armed. Are you all right? Of course. We're having a picnic here. Really? It's just a single crow. Pancakes? That was sarcasm. Ah, yet I know. No pancakes there, huh? You know, where do the crows go to drink? Actually, I could just take the cartridge. I I'm warning you. Really? What would you do? I could bite off your fingers for one thing. <laughs> What do you mean? Have you got a hole in your trachea? No. Want one? Wow. Doc keeps a bottle of champagne in his office. What? Where? Sorry, Ghoul. Aww. I'll leave for this later. Ah, okay. Doc? Are you all right? Oh, right, the gag. Uh, there. Better now? Yes. Oh, peachy. Okay, then I can leave now, right? Yes. Well, you know, it's not like we couldn't use a little help. I see. What exactly happened? It came out of nowhere. Well, actually, they came through the door. They just overwhelmed us and took us prisoner. Apparently, they're after the Ascension Codes. You think so? Well, they did say things like, where are the Ascension Codes, and so on. I tried to explain that we can't give them the codes right now. They wouldn't listen. Any ideas? Alas, no. My hands are tied, so to speak. Well, your hands are tied, actually. That, too. Perhaps Lady Gold can think of something. Her cartridge is still in the implant.
This element on Donna's temple, is that also an implant? Yes, I mounted it myself. Why do you ask? I think I have a plan. I recommend that you get a second opinion. <laughs> Just leave that to me. Do I have a choice? Nope. Let me try something. I would cross my fingers for you, but being tied up and all that. No problem. Hey, what the... Alright. Hello, Mr. Wise. Welcome. Happy Tuesday. Hey, How are what you are doing? you doing? Nice body. Although the eye patch might impede my aim. Don't! Whoa, lady. Oh, it's fine, actually. Oh, Was that right. necessary? Did you have a better idea? Yes! Too late. Oh, well. One less worry, at least. Now all we have to do is subdue the rebels. All we need is a new... Don't say it. Plan. Oh. I can feel a flash of inspiration ambling in my general direction. Particles of ingenuity are wafting through the air. Hmm. Use vacuum cleaner engine with bubble gum? Perhaps later. Does it always have to be a complicated plan? I thought that's what you like about me. You seem to confuse me with Spunky Gold. Spunky Gold, but of course. I've got Lee Bold's remote, right? Everything is slowly falling into place. My past self is going to insert Spunky Gold in Lee Bold. She will then subdue Yanosh while I take care of Garleth. And voila, we're out of here. Past self? What are you talking about? Can't we just leave the same way you came in here? No, we can't. Because of the, the temporal coherence and the, and the spatial thingamy and, and, and so forth. It's complicated. Isn't it always? Uh, I'll explain it to you later. Now, we need to find Spunky Gold's cartridge. Here, might as well take this one. Hey, awesome! You're not half bad. Only one third, actually. Just <laughs> trust me. You go free the others. I'll take care of the rebels. But first, I'm gonna grab a gun. And I get Donna's remote. If it makes you happy. Oh, man. This is gonna be so totally epic. All right, I'm going to run the ads. If you're not the sub, you may get ads for a few minutes. And uh, we'll continue afterwards, so stay tuned. I'm also going to keep timer running one more time. For having forgotten to turn it on earlier. And we do have some boosts. No, we don't have any boosts. Okay. I already did the parrot boosts. Never mind. We just wait. We just wait. I wonder if this is towards the end of the game. The first one looks like... Uh, to me, the first one looked like it was ending three times or so. Three different, th three different points. I thought it was ending. Maybe four different points, actually. So this could be something like that as well. We definitely finished the first big chunk of the game, though. With the inventory reset and... Um... Life-giving water. Thank you for the reminder, Pat. So I'm wondering how much is left. Well, we are probably not finishing it today, but still. I'd like to be able to finish it tomorrow. We'll see. Timer. is only a third of our... Well, then you multiply the time with, with three. Easy as that. Isn't that how math works? You don't think that's how it works? Huh. I really feel like that's how it should work. You got a gut feeling, but is it a good gut feeling? Or is it a git good feeling? Because if it's a git good feeling, then that probably means you are bad at math, and I'm right. More like indigestion. 
Hmm. I'm not sure how that relates to maths. <laughs> oh man, if Wrath gets selected, I should probably consider getting the Season Pass 2 DLC. I haven't seen a good, uh, good discount for it though. Might be allergic. Allergic to math or? Yeah, we are missing the season pass to DLC. I mean, it's okay. I would play the game without all the DLCs and I wouldn't mind it terribly. If I don't get it, we'll just do it that way. Anyway, welcome back everyone. Let's go back to the game. So. This is the remote that future Rufus gave me earlier. The one that belongs to Lebo. Pathology Thaisness. Ah. Welcome back. And what about your wonderful plan? I'm working on it. Crowbar and weapon. <laughs> Finally, I've got a gun, too. <laughs> and who's the better man now? Huh? Stupid future Rufus. What? I totally forgot to ask. Do you mind if I borrow your mind? Super. Doc? Are you all mm. Mm. Oh, right, the gag. But he's future, Rufus. Uh, there. Better now? Yes. Oh, peachy. Okay, then I can leave now, right? Yes. Well, it's not like we couldn't. I see. Let me... I would not. Hey, what the... Well, maybe we just force open the door. I mean, I, okay, we didn't need to force it open. It's, it was just open. Hey, open up. It's me, Rufus. Uh-oh, that must be me from the past. I should open up. Otherwise, I'll screw up causality. Okay, I might have to remember the choices I made in the yes. previous dialogue. Uh, Yoohoo! Can I come in for a the moment? puzzles like that, that in work. Escape from Monk Island, Heroines soon. Quest. First, you have to do something for me. Um, here. And what other game? There's a third game. What's this? Another remote? Yes, it's Leibold's. It seems to be an older model, but hey, I know how to use a remote. Yeah. <laughs> Of course you do. Liebold is the fat one, right? I'm only asking because I haven't seen an implant. You can do it. When you're finished, you can use the portal. Then I'll explain everything. Huh? What portal? Trust me, and not a word to Yanosh. Whew, good thing I have a perfect memory. One little mistake, and I'd have an invalid timeline. But what happens next? Hmm. <laughs> one shouldn't live in the past anyway. I gotta open the portal now. Maybe crowbar with the electrodes. Well then, let's do it. Cool. Now what? There you are at last. What took you so long? Just because you're from the past doesn't mean there's no need to hurry. Huh? What's going on here? Is that you, Cletus? Don't be silly. I'm your future self, of course. These portals are space-time curvatures. And this is the future. Da, 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 da. They, they call, call him Rufus. Hey, that's my jingle. Not anymore. Days I'm more up-to-date, wiser, and way cooler than you. Is that so? Huh, I want proof. All right. Anything to make you shut up. A simple test will show that you're nothing but a puffed up loudmouth. Or you, exactly. So, what am I thinking of right Zibble now? Zibble. No, no, wait, wait. I remember now. You're thinking of. Zeebel Zoobel. Ha! Missed it by a mile, you clown. Zeebel Zoobel. <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. You're an imposter. I knew that right away. No, I'm not. I had to say that. So I wouldn't create a time paradox. Yeah, yeah, right. Just admit that I won. Why? Why? What were you thinking of? If it wasn't Zebel Zubel, well, actually, it was. Uh... <clears throat> hey, 
Hey, <laughs> future me, old pal, there you are. How's that for a surprise? I told you so. Can we finally get going now? You need to go in there and rescue Gold. So she's really in there? Is she all right? Don't panic. Wink and Nod have been put out of action. What? You overwhelmed them both all by yourself? That ah, was nothing. Looks like you're really me after all. How did you pull that off? Ah, you'll, you'll soon figure it out yourself. Meanwhile, I'm gonna take care of the rebels. Whoa, is that really a gun? No, it's a banana peeler. Of course it's a gun. Can I try it? Not now. You're headed to the lab. You need to free Goal, remember? Oh, well, I'll go rescue Goal then. I'm sure I'll do it way cooler than you did, and she'll end up being much freer than she did with you. Please do it just as cool as I did, or I'm gonna dissolve. And that is really painful, you know? <laughs> Me like. Rufus! Yeah, yeah, I know. Spoil sport. But afterwards, I'll get the gun, right? Yes, sure! <clears throat> Through the portal? Okay. And hurry, the clock's about to strike the hour here, and then the rebels will storm the office. All right, what a hero. I'm gonna be someone. Yeah, what a moron. Who does he think <laughs> he is? But now back to the mission at hand. The clock could strike the hour at any moment now. Oh, no, it's I'll be ready. Are you also in the <laughs> All time I need loop? now is a little patience. And nobody beats me at that. Patience. I'd rather wait until they come in. And that will happen as soon as the clock strikes the hour, which shouldn't be too long now. Say not so from the word in which shouldn't that this be game is 12 too years long old. Now. Oh, darn. Say not so from wording. Obviously has no sense of time. Welcome God cuts. God dude, I cannot really read. Welcome, good to see you. Okay, uh You got to strike the clock. Let's right, strike. Now, let's strike that's the clock. Enough. Strike, will ya? Oh, come on, strike. <laughs> what? Ouch. Did you hear that? The clock is striking the arrow. And right on the spot. It's time for your grand entrance, Dolly. Uh, the boy is really acting. Quick question. Usually it's you who wins at what people she shows. But usually it's only about who fetches a fresh bag of chips. Stop trying to make a stupid One for all. And today, the one is you. Rufus, what are you doing here? There's been a change of plan. Goal is going to hang on to the Ascension Codes. Turning against the Resistance. Whose side are you on then? Always on the winning side. Yeah, well, sometimes. What the... <laughs> it's jammed? Ah, tough luck. <laughs> or not. Rufus? <laughs> Very good. You made it on your own. Come with me. It's not over yet. Uh, wait a second. But, Goal, we haven't got time now for for that kind of thing. I mean, shouldn't we wait until you're, you know, back in shape? Oh, well, why not? What? <laughs> you know, you really need to shave. <laughs> Let's what the heck? I did it! See? I told you I could! Doc? Why are you still trussed up? Lady Goal was supposed to untie you! But she didn't! She escaped to the future through the portal! She did what? what? Uh, uh, no problem. Spunky Goal is still outside, in Lee Bold's body. She'll make Lady Goal see reason. That wasn't Spunky Goal. That was a cleaning cartridge for my video recorder. <laughs> the other two goals are still in the machine. Lee Bold doesn't even have an implant. But, but, but the remote! Oh, oh my. That means I just... Rufus! What have you done to Gorleth? And to Liebold? He seems to be quite distressed. Uh, a case of mistaken identity? I... Hey! Better get the flamethrower. What's this all about? I am sorry, Rufus. I just have to make one more change to your plan, I'm afraid. What? 
Huh? Change my plan? Yes. Once again, it's complicated, just like everything that involves you. You cause nothing but chaos. But I'm not made for that. I can no longer stay with you. Oh, come on. What brought this on? Open up! Don't even try. The door is bolted. I need a little head start if I want to find Cletus. Cletus? But what are you talking about? We were going to go to Elysium together, save the world and all that. It just doesn't work that way, Rufus. You can't let everybody down and still be the hero. That's impossible. Hey, impossible is my middle name. You said it. It appeals to you, doesn't it? You always want what's impossible, and therefore you will never be content. You can't come to Elysium Spanky Rufus lady and baby. because you carry Deponia within you. Farewell, trash baby. Aww. But wait a sec! That's harsh. But what about your surgery? We need to put you back together again. What for? So I will be flooded with doubt again? No thanks, Rufus. But we were gonna save the world together! That may be true for Spunky Goal and Baby Goal, but I am neither as idealistic nor as adventurous as they are. I just want to go home before it's too late. But I want to go to Elysium with you. Do you really want to do that? I know you've got something to prove. Because you grew up in the garbage. Because nobody ever believed in you. But would you yeah, really be girl. happy if you achieved your goal? No more adventures? No more plans? I don't think so. But Cletus is a snotty jerk. Cletus is not a bad person, Rufus. At least no worse than I am. And certainly no worse than you. I'm a thousand times better than that pretty boy. At least you would like to be. I forgave you for splitting my mind, for lying to me, for repeatedly putting me in harm's way. And I forgave Cletus for trying to erase my memory. Now you need to forgive me. But where's the problem? Why can't we save Deponia and still go to Elysium together? Because it is mutually exclusive, Rufus. But it isn't. I know I can do it. This is about what you don't know. Have you ever asked yourself why they want to blow up Deponia? What's that got to do with anything? Everything, really. Elysium isn't the paradise you think it is. It is just a vessel, a starship, designed to leave Deponia once and for all, so that we can start over on Utopia, the nearest inhabitable planet. But Utopia is far away. There is only one possibility of generating enough energy to catapult Elysium there. Oh. The destruction of Deponia. What was that? Elysium is... what? A... Uh, a starship? Now, do you finally understand? If Deponia is not though. blown up, then as soon Elysium as Barbie will soon fall back to the planet. We cannot live forever without a home planet. But Deponia is no place to live. We both know that. What if the Council of Elders knew that Deponia was inhabited? I don't know. Part of me always believed they would stop the blast then, but that was starry-eyed gold. Why is this all happening now? Elysium wasn't designed to float in the atmosphere forever. It took the Organon decades to build the required blast towers. They are distributed all over the planet, and now, Everything's ready. Ulysses' people stuck to their schedule. Elysium needs to be launched now, or it's going to fall back onto the planet. Hmm. So, Elysium is a starship? You've got it! Our fathers constructed Elysium so Deponia could be evacuated, so that we can start over on Utopia, the nearest inhabitable planet. But there was only room for a lucky few. They couldn't take everyone. Well, what's so great about this utopia? The grass is fresh and green. The sky is blue. The water runs clear. In other words, it is not Deponia. Okay, I think I understand now, but... But what? But I still don't get it. Is it really that hard to understand? It wouldn't be if you could explain it better. Okay, I think I understand now, but... But what? 
But there must be a way! There are even two ways. One leads to Elysium, and from there, on to Utopia. The other one ends here on Deponia, if we survive, that is. I have made my decision, Rufus. Now, it's up to you. Take me with you to Utopia, then. And allow them to destroy Deponia. You don't really want that, Rufus. There is too much good in you. What? You There's no good in me. That. You could never be so ruthless. Yes, I can. Could, how would you be any different from Cletus? He's uglier. Ah, uh, who cares about Deponia? Just as long as I'm with you. I don't believe you mean that. Then let us save Deponia together! But I've already explained! Saving Deponia would mean the end of Elysium! That's it fine. It would end up as just another mound of trash on this garbage dump of a planet! But I can't live like this! I thought you would be able to relate to that, Rufus! It's gonna be a bit of work. So what? I've made my mind up, Rufus. I'm sorry. There has to be a way to accomplish both! Trust me! Deponia I can fix German everything! Just like you managed to really? fix me! All I want is a second chance! You had your chance, Rufus. Deponia had its chance. Sometimes things are actually broken beyond repair. You can keep the other two cartridges. They contain nothing but doubts and silly ideals. I can't use those where I'm bound. I've got to hurry! Donna Submersible awaits. If I don't wow. make it to Porto Fisco with Cletus by the day after tomorrow, oh, land still. it will be too late. Good luck, Rufus. But... <sighs> so it literally means oh, landfill. It literally means Are trash. Are you out of your mind? She's gonna kill us all! I think she's fascinating. Most importantly, she appears to be the part that knows the Ascension codes. We must stop her somehow. But we're locked in. First, untie me. And then we'll think of something. There is always a way. Yeah, like you need to tell me that. Huzzah! Malevolent karma, so close to a drama. Scarza's <coughs> fresh doubts in her horse disarray. And she left him behind, though still not in one mind. Planning to reunite with her fierce fiancé But if you think it's time for a first to resign So close to the finish line, you don't know him at all For heroes gather momentum on the brink of the maggot on a squall By the squall, they put balls to the wall The sun balls to the wall Put balls to the wall? Okay We shall put balls to the wall Better. You'll need them. Then they are put to the wall. Hell yeah. Rufus! Rufus! Hmm. Rufus. Ah, there you are. Ready for Shishash? Uh, Janos, there really isn't a whole lot of room on the trawler, and, uh... Yes, it's a shame I can't come. I would love to fight on the front line, side by side, like way back then. Way back then? Well, early today then, <laughs> but alas, it's not possible. <laughs> I have a mission of my own. Uh-huh. Well, that takes precedence, of course. At this point, our organization is simply not large enough you. to take on the Organon. You think so? Therefore, I too will travel to Porto Fisco. I'm in contact with the group there that has also taken up the fight against oppression. The passage is already booked. We are going to establish the resistance shell north, right under the nose of the Organon. How does that sound? Uh, good luck. Thanks. By the way, I must ask you a favor in this context. When you are in Porto Fisco, you must definitely pay us a fish it. I'm certain that people will want to meet the spiritual father of the movement. We'll see. Here, you're going to need this. What is it? We have agreed on a new secret knock. <laughs> Eh, yeah, well, the old one was a piece of crap. Exactly. Secret Nobody knock. Nobody was really able to memorize it. 
Hmm. You know, Janosch, I've really got to go. Yes. Time for you to leave. Adventure is calling. So it is. It's calling. Will you finally shut up, you numbskull? At last? What kept you? Ah, we'll never catch up to the submersible this way. It's not my fault. I was harassed by some bum. Where are we going, anyway? <laughs> my Donna self mentioned Portofisco, so that's where we should go. I think we Which should one first is this, try to uh, locate spiky. the signal from the submersible. I seem to remember there's a radio mast on Isla Watch It. Perhaps I can manipulate the transmitter so that our sonar will recognize the signature of the submersible. By then, Donna will be long gone. No thanks. I say Isla Watch It. Bozo is the captain, and he wants to go to Fisco too, right? We can head for the polar ice cap, as far as I'm concerned. Just as long as you finally agree on something. Enough. I will decide where we're going. Uh, Rufus, those aren't the navigation controls. That's my ear hair remover. Ah. <laughs> so what is this? Floating black mark. Are you serious? We can actually go to four different islands? Hell yeah, Monkey Island 2 all over again. And I was saying maybe we are closer to finishing the game. Now there are three different locations. Wow. Well, uh... Let's go to them in order, right? What? That's supposed to be the pole? Lonzo puts more no, ice in the when he wants to save alcohol. What a disappointment. Oh crap. The button is frozen. No wonder the pizza guy never showed up. Oh crap. The water tap is frozen. So much for my idea of a skating rink. The hose isn't frozen. This could be useful. I'll take it. Take it. Wow. The last time I could see the stars this clearly in Kuvak, I was nine. I probably shouldn't have removed the filter from the town's trash burning generator. The sign is bigger than the pole. It puts the lotion on its skin. Or else it gets the hose again. I could really use a torch like that. But to get it, I'll need something to melt the ice. Some sort of, hmm, I don't know, portable fire. Bummer. Portable fire. Plus, minus, plus. What is that supposed to mean? I must say, I'm nonplussed. <laughs> That's cool enough already. That's cool and unfortunately, lazy bump. Okay. It may look like I was standing on the hose, but in reality, that rotten hose stuffed itself under my feet to make me look bad. Unfortunately, Doc hasn't lazy bum. Unfortunately, lazy. All right. So I don't think there's actually much we can do here right now. I could really use but to get it. I'll need something to melt some sort of portable fine bummer. So to get the torch, we need a torch. Understood. How about that? Now I can finally wash my feet, or brush my teeth, or water the flowers I was gonna donate to the orphanage. <laughs> As if. Hmm. Well, okay. This is not a big island. Oh, there's tea here. Careful, tea's hot. Did I just hear a challenge? No, I. Oh! Ouch! Ooh, darn it! Why? I warned you. Careful. Did I just? Don't drink it. Just pick. Ah, oh, come. Oh! Ouch! I won't. What if you put ice in it? What are you making? 
iced tea. But the tea was against the cold. So, I don't believe in wasting food. And I still have to watch you throw away the fries I stuck up your nose during the night. Now it should be all right. Don't do it. The tea is... Hot? Hardly. No, I mean it's also... Weak. Uh-oh. Are we going to pee? It's true what they say. You just can't stop the melting at the poles. This is such an absurd puzzle. I'm sure he won't mind. But this is, you know, the word moon logic gets thrown out around constantly. It, to me, it doesn't usually apply. This time, this is one of the best examples of moon logic I have ever seen. As far as adventure game puzzles go. So we have a torch. What about Loon yeah. Logic? Bozo's Loon Logic is a whole other concept that uh, not many people can even comprehend. Out of every opening. I'll keep so I'm not going to try and explain it now. For the furious finale. <laughs> yeah. Bozo's trawler would seem a lot cooler. I'll keep that. Yeah. Bo I'll keep Nice. Can we melt the so, song? He's finally agreed that it's time to pass the torch to the next generation. Signs are useless. They don't even burn. Not even when they have flames painted on them. This tall that's missing and phases two wait, through wait, an wait, estimated wait. twelve. Oh, this is... torch fits perfectly into phase one of my plan. All that's missing now is fire. And phases two through an estimated twelve. <laughs> it should be possible to build something useful out of it. A wick extinguisher for wildfires? Mm, no. This torch fits all the art. Well, we are. We may possibly be done here. Ah, Rufus. Found any trace of that submersible yet? I'm working on it. And you're really sure you can put gold back together? Of course. I just need the third cartridge. The one that's in Donna's implant. Exactly. The rest will be child's play. Although the sea is anything but calm, perhaps I should think about adding some stabilizers to the bone saw. Would you happen to know if Goal is a hemophiliac? I know you can do it. Have you got any idea how we might capture Donna? I suggest we travel to Isla Watch It. There's an old radio mast there. If we modify the transmitter just a little, we might be able to track the submersible. Isla, watch it. Now that sounds inviting. I hope you're wearing your long johns. The island lies in the center of a permanent storm system. Oh, wow. come on. I'm not afraid of a little bit of weather. But you should be. Remember, you'll be working on electrical installations on top of a radio mast in a thunderstorm. Now, oh, so what? You wouldn't believe all the hazard warnings I've ignored so far. I'll carry on then. Keep me posted. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? Except for the fact that you steered us straight into the eternal ice. At least I didn't steer us into an iceberg. But you did! And why can't I remember that? Probably because you were hit on the head by a refrigerator when the polar bears attacked us. What? Huh. I seem to have missed a few things. You certainly did. It was pretty cool. Ah. We missed the cool part. It really is very cold here. <laughs> you weakling. Can't you even stand a little cold? Yeah, more than you. Oh, really? Really. There's only one way to find out. Ice, Ice swimming. swimming! What? Are you serious? Ice swimming? Wait, that's dangerous. Hey. Eh. Why am I getting so upset? I can still dream of my happy place. <laughs> mm -hmm. Happy, happy, happy. I said no icebergs below the belt. Can't help it if you mumble. What, did, did we swim and come back already? <sighs> hey, Bozo, you should check your propeller. Some lunatic tied a penguin to it. No problem. 
I'll take care of it later. But be careful, you might ruin our slide. <laughs> happy, happy, happy. What are we doing here anyway? Shouldn't you know the answer to that? As you're the one who guided us here? Yes, but I mean, you know how things are. Every task breaks into subtasks, which in turn break into more subtasks. It's easy to get lost somewhere in there. Ah, I see. Have you seen the stars? Focus on your job instead, Mr. Head in the Clouds. I have to defend Rufus. Once upon a time, seafarers used to orient themselves by the stars. Exactly. I wanted to orient myself by the stars and not be enchanted by their twinkling. Okay. On we go. I hope you know what you're doing. Of course I do. What was that? That's my new jingle. Hmm. Needs a little bass if you ask me. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? I'm cold. <laughs> Even though you're so hot. <laughs> oh, dear. Perhaps I'm running a fever. Even though I always eat my veggies like a good girl. It really is very cold here. If you want to warm up... Yes? Drink some tea. Eh. But be careful. <laughs> it's very hot. There's time enough to be careful when we're dead, babe. What are we doing here anyway? I don't know what you're doing, but I'm freezing. Yeah, too bad I threw the chest with the electric blankets overboard. Why exactly did you do that? Hey, you stay out of this. I'm not asking you why, why you went off your diet. That was me. Wow. Have you had any of the tea? Only a little. It's still very hot. Hey, nothing's too hot for me, babe. You shouldn't drink too much tea anyway. It's very weak. And someone flooded the toilet. But that someone now also knows what direction the water spirals when you flush over the pole. And that it doesn't spiral at all if you stuff Doc's Long John's down there. Wow. Have you seen the stars? You want to look at the stars with me? Oh, that is so romantic. Yeah, exactly. That's why I said it. And not because I want to erase some things from your diary in the meantime. You're sweet. On we go. I'll follow you anywhere. Okay. All ship shape, mate? Actually, the correct address would be Captain. Yeah, we can talk about your promotion later. First, I've got a couple of questions. Can't this tub go any faster? We'll never catch up to Donna Gold this way. That's no way to talk about Donna Gold. She's Isn't one of the that most a city in Ireland? The rust red sea. She may not look like much on the outside, but. But oh, her inner beauty! Sorry, Bozo, but I overheard Tony often enough trying to set up her cousins with someone. I notice right away when someone's trying to sugarcoat a slug. She's not a slug. She's big bones, that's all. What good is the fastest vessel if we don't even know where our target is? That's beside the point. We use the same fine line to fix up Dottie May and Broomstick Budwin. Four weeks later, everyone called him Vacuum Hose Budwin. So, what do we know now? I think Goal is right. We should visit Porto Fisco first. I don't know. That's where Janosch was headed, too. But that's good. He might be able to help us. In what way? Is the indentation in your chair not wide enough? Or do you need someone who sorts your chip crumbs by flavor? You shouldn't underestimate him. In times like these, people will transcend their own limits. <laughs> Obviously, he started with his trousers. So, what do we know now? I think Goal is right. We should visit Porto Fisco for... Uh, but he in what is the... Or you and Tuck... <laughs> Do I get to steer, too? Uh, I don't know. Do I get to run around like a madman, then, and get us involved in a series of disasters? Was that a yes? That was a go jump in the lake. Back to work, sailor! Hey, I'm still the captain of this ship. Say what? This is outright scrutiny! Mutiny. No screw. <laughs> Just stay focused, sailor. Just because there's a woman on board, we must not allow our thoughts to wander. Alright, let's see.
north wall. So we can go back here. Why would we want to do that? Today is not your lucky day, Seagull. My people rummaged through every pile of garbage, but they found no trace of the girl. She was here. Why would I lie to you? I don't know. You appear to suffer from an inflated ego, just like your son. Rufus is not my son. You can do whatever you want with him. But we had a deal. You wanted a tip, and I gave you one. Can I help it if your people are totally incompetent? You are wasting my time. Ooh. And I can't stand it when my time is being wasted. Hey, you! Tone it down a bit. You're scaring the fish. I'm sorry. It won't happen again. I want every nook and cranny of this junk pile turned inside out once more and close off all access to the harbor. Even if a rat tries to get out of here, I want to know. That was Argus with his bloodhounds. So the Organon is already after us. Shh! He's right. We need to be careful. Okay. Hey, what do you think you're doing? I, I'm, uh, I'm uh, b bowing before Neptune. Or, uh, isn't that him? What? Where? Are you mocking me? Mocking, robbing, something like that, yeah. So we got bait. Unfortunately, this tall that's and it may, but it, I managed. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? I don't know. Are you certain Argus won't catch us? Mm, nothing is certain. At least not as long as you're around. Huh? What? But you're the nice Goal. Did I mix up the cartridges? No, no. Spunky Goal just scribbled a couple of tips on my arm. <laughs> we have to get into the gadget shop. Too bad. It's closed. Yeah, no stupid door can stop me. You're not going to break in, are you? Why not? Oh, how exciting. What are you going to do? Are you going to kick in the door? Three guesses, babe. Oh, wow. Even though it's double titanium reinforced and it will really, really hurt. Uh, uh two left. <laughs> On we go. I'll follow you anywhere. Okay, first, can we go in and what happens if we do? Ah, found any trace of that s I'm working The Organon has sealed off the floating black market. So Argus is already hot on our trail. That's a bad thing. The Organon always used to leave us alone here. Don't worry, Doc. They'll pay for their misdeeds, for all the suffering and the damage they've caused. I'm just wondering, do you think they will also pay for the damage you have done? Uh, sure. They will pay through their noses for their misdeeds and mine. I'll carry on then. Keep me posted. All ship shape, mate? Actually. Yeah, we can t first. And here we are again, in the floating black market. Something's wrong here. No lights, no drunks falling into the harbor. There should be a lot more hustle and bustle here. See? No Rufus, no party. Or maybe it's because of the Organon battleships my sonar is detecting. No, I liked my version better. Back but, up. Uh, all right. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? Of course. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? I feel wonderful. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? Well, one third of my mind has fled. The Organon is occupying the floating black market. And if we don't do something soon, Ulysses will blow up the planet right under our feet. I told Perfect. you this would be fun. I thought you were just bragging. We have to get into the gadget shop. 
The Organon occupies the floating black market, and the first thing you think of is a looting spree? Uh, actually, the first thing I thought of was arson. Arson? Stupid idea, I know. And how? The roofs are much too wet. On we go. I hope you know what you're doing. All right. Now let's look at properly. How's it going? Shh. I'll let me work. I'm not afraid of good for you, but please go crow about that somewhere else. You're too noisy. You're scaring the fish. Oh, get off it. You're afraid of the Organon, too. Just get lost. I thought you said you weren't afraid. Uh, that's right, I'm not. Are you still trying to tell me that you're not afraid of the Organon? No, I'm not trying to tell you anything. I'm trying to be left alone. So, scram! And the fact that the floating black market is under attack doesn't bother you? Not in the least. The only thing that's bothering me is you. If you're not afraid, then why did you stop fishing? Guess why? <laughs> you're trembling all over. Your palms are sweaty. Telltale signs that you're scared. Wrong! The problem's you. Whenever you're in the vicinity, all I catch is boots. So, scram! Go ahead. Keep fishing, you ninny. Not until you go away. Could you please catch a boot for me? What a dumb thing to ask. If word gets around, they might boot me out of the fishing association. Is that the biggest of your worries? The fishing association? No, not with you around. <laughs> I won't go away until you catch me a boot. Are you waiting for me to lose my patience? Don't make me laugh, you fidgety wimp. I'm a fisherman. I once solved Gilligan's cube by just waiting until all the <laughs> colors had faded. Was that a challenge? No, it was a demand for unconditional surrender. <laughs> You're barking up the wrong tree. I have never, ever given up. Yeah, we'll see. Your feet will rot before I lose my patience. Ha! <laughs> told you. You're no match. How's it going? Get lost. Oh, come for a comma. I can Any kind of black fish, blue fish, old fish, new fish. Fish with laces? Nope. Oh, dang. You can't do it, can you? Not as long as you're standing there. Back, 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 back. You wasting your time. A fisherman always keeps his cool. This is a free country. I can stand wherever I want to. Not on my pier. I don't uh -uh. see a sign. Well, maybe you need an extra pupil. A fish hook in your eye should do the trick. Come on. I'll be quiet. I promise. Even if I did believe that, although you keep proving the opposite, you're still unlucky. As long as you're standing here, I'll catch nothing but boots. I won't go away until you catch me a boot. You waiting for me to lose my patience? Don't make me laugh, you fidgety wimp. I'm a fisherman. I once solved Gilligan. Was that? A no, it was a. <laughs> Your bark. I have. Yeah, we'll see. Your feet will rot before I lose my patience. So if you talk to him, what happens if you walk? Ha! <laughs> okay. All right. All right. How's it going? Uh. I won't. Yo, I was I. You're f Let's wait. Let's wait for a little bit. Is this really necessary, Rufus? You stay out of this. It's important. Oh, good grief. All right, this is the game telling me that I'm on the right track, I think. Or it is a huge red herring. Hey, drummer. How are you, man? Good to see you. Come on, Rufus. I'm cold. Never. Please, Rufus, I'm cold. Let's go. Did you hear that? The girl's cold. Nice try, buddy. I'm looking for a boot, not a red herring. Maybe I'm looking for a red boot with a herring in it. Rufus, I'm freezing to death! Holy mackerel, you take care of the girl already? She's wearing nothing but PJs. Tragic, isn't it? <laughs> Power 
good match. Hey, Jack and Raiders. Rufus, a Welcome, Weapon of Allure. Okay, Welcome, No okay. Matter Fail. Welcome, up. everybody. Can't bear to see her suffer. Thank you so much for the raid. Here's How are your you stupid boot. Welcome, and Harrison. <laughs> you see, Gull? I Hello, won Char. a worn out boot. Impressive, huh? My hero. Welcome, Link. All right, uh, let's. Let's mute this so we can give you a shout out. Welcome everyone. Thank you so much for the raid, Jack and Raiders. Your sound card works perfectly. Thank you for the follow. Witnessing the witness. Fuck. First try. First try. First try, I bet it's like the hundred try or something. What do I do? What do I do? <laughs> Congratulations. Well done. I did it. You did it. <laughs> How are you, Jack? How was your stream? How is the witness going? Thank you so much for the raid. Raiders, thank you for joining the raid and coming over here. I'm Mitral. We play lots of RPGs and points and click adventures here. And uh, I hope you enjoy your time here. And Jack plays a lot of very cool puzzle games. She plays other games as well, but she plays a lot of very interesting uh, in the puzzle games as well. And uh, she's very chill. She's very cool. Definitely give her a follow. Check her channel out. Watch her stream. She's amazing. And uh, yeah, Witness is great. So I'm glad you're enjoying it. How was the stream? Did you make much progress? How did the game go? We are playing Deponia. This is the second game in the Deponia series. Um, it is an absolutely fantastic adventure game. As far as puzzles go, for the most part at least, the character is a horrendous, very hateable, uh, probably the, one of the most annoying point and click protagonists ever. If you are not familiar with this game, if you are a fan of point and click adventures, you may want to not watch and play instead. But if you want to, if you decide to stay here, welcome. Hope you have a great time. And we'll see how this goes. W what's wrong, Jack? Uh, are you, are you ill? Whatever the case might be, I hope you feel better soon. You have COVID. Oh, I'm so sorry. Well, uh, thankfully, it's, it's so much easier to recover from COVID these days uh, nevertheless it may still give you some trouble hopefully it's not giving you too much trouble you're on demand well that's great to hear I'm, I'm glad you are doing better already Jack and I hope you fully recover as soon as possible by the way did, did you play the Deponia series I'm not sure if I talked to you about it before, but let me ask Why you Why is the food bowl out here when the cat is locked up inside? Either someone is acting out their sadism, or the cat knows a secret way to get outside. Okay, so what if... Okay, first first of all, let's try the shoe everywhere. I managed to hook this already. You didn't? You have been coming into lurk for short bursts because you might want to. Yeah, uh, I, I think you might want to play this game I've been finding some of the puzzles really excellently built uh, really some of the greatest puzzles I've seen in adventure games including the great classics a couple of the puzzles I have really loved through and through uh, the, the character himself is, is you know the reason I put off playing this game for years is because of the character and he didn't disappoint he is absolutely terrible and annoying but if you can get past that if you can you know accept him for what he is i think the game itself the puzzles are great this great. and the game is hilarious perfectly into all the fate it may look like i but in the most but they would all right. No. all right all right so bait maybe we can put this here to see where here, the cat comes kitty, out kitty, of kitty 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 here kitty Look what yummies I have here. Huh. The cat doesn't seem to be interested in this. 
What are you? Probably only eats tuna, spoiled beast. Well, I think it's sweet. Oh, tuna? It's so small. It's so soft. You're soft in the head. Rock for tuna. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty. Show Uncle Rufus the secret way into the gadget shop. Yeah, it's not listening. Which is obviously due to the fact that cats, in general, have very poor hearing. They don't. They just don't care about you. Or humans. That's Gilligan's cat. Hmm. I wonder if it knows a secret way into the gadget shop. I'll try pushing it open. The door was firmly locked. <laughs> Who said that? I'll try. The door was firmly locked. Can we pick the lock? I'll try. The door was. I'll try. The door. I wonder if Baby Gold would have a different reaction. Let's see. B -b -b baby Gold! B -b -b baby Gold! Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Look what you. Huh, the cat doesn't. Sad. It probably only eats tuna. Then okay. it can't complain when it starves. I can almost hear it calling. Help! Oh, I'm dying! Stop it! Oh, meow! Help! Uh, uh, tell my family! I said stop it, okay? Wow, baby gold can be dramatic. anything hmm do you still remember how I protected you from that dragon uh, let me put that another way did I miss anything that didn't happen just inside your head huh where else okay all right I don't think we can do much here so let's try the other places maybe we will find tuna somewhere else before actually the the cat starves. Alright, uh, third place. Where is this? This is Isla Washits. I think. Lousy weather. We should make sure we finish up here as quickly as possible. The crust on my overcoat is starting to dissolve. Exhausts. Here's a tank for diesel. Ouch! Ah! As long as the generator is on, it's too hot to fiddle with. I'll Do we have still have sugar? Somehow. We don't still have sugar. I should be able to siphon off some diesel with that. As soon Ouch. as we put ah! it off. As long as the generator is on, it's too hot to fiddle with. I'll have to put it out of commission somehow. All right. Oh, yeah, that would be epic. It really is high time I found some fire. No way. You are not gonna blow up the generator. Huh, they're oily enough already. Maybe I can siphon off the diesel. Unfortunately, there are several holes in the shoe. Hmm, so step one, turn off the generator. Step two, uh, siphon off the diesel via the hose into the shoe. Wait, that's the next step. The the current step is mend the shoe with something. We're gonna find something. Unfortunately, dark happens. Okay. What we can we go back into the cutter? And um, where did gold go? Gold is oh gold is here. Okay. Let's talk to gold in this location. Hey gold, everything okay? I feel wonderful. Ah, found any time working. I'll keep all ships actually. Yeah, we can first. Uh, what island is this? Its name is actually Isla Watch It, but the sailors call it the Hell Hole. Oh, sounds exciting. Not really. The island is really nothing more than another pile of junk protruding from the sea. It's only on the map because of the constant thunderstorms. Sailors should give it a wide berth, so you'd better hurry with your radio mast. The last thing we can use now is a crash. <laughs> 
that may be the last thing you can use. The last thing I can use is red beets and advice. Red beets and advice. What's wrong with red beets? Back to work. But I... Uh... Ah, found any... I'm working... No, I agree with you about the advice part. What are we doing here again? We need to modify the transmitter on the radio mast. But there's a heavy thunderstorm. You need to bring that transmitter here. Why is it always me who has to do the dirty work? You're right. It's way too dangerous. It's a job for a real man. And that's why you should stay in here. <laughs> I'll get the transmitter. Period. Ah, you really think so? Oh, well. <laughs> like putty in my hands. You feel I'll carry on then. Keep me posted. Is there something wrong with chat? No, chat is okay. My ad manager disappeared for some reason. I can't see my ad timer anymore. Oh well, it should come up. Wait. It might actually be ad time. In a minute or so. But it just disappeared on me. Okay, uh, let me check this. So that it doesn't... Kind of sneak... Sneak on us, the ads. Access denied. So the only channels that can run ads have access to the ads manager at this time. Uh, what? All right, there's something seriously wrong with Twitch for me, it seems. I can see my stream. I cannot see. Uh, my profile picture, I cannot see. Deliver counts. I cannot see the follower counts. Oh wait, they can't. They came back. Okay, I can see it all now. Okay, the ad is back as well. Ads are back as well. For some reason, the page refused to load properly. Uh, but it's fixed now. I don't know. Maybe a hiccup with the connection. Who knows? As long as it's fixed, I don't, I'm not worried. You know, I'm I'm getting a little paranoid. The the government has actually blocked Instagram uh, over here due to some. I'm not going to get into the details, but due to some posts that the government didn't like, and they asked Instagram to remove them, and of course Instagram said. You know, go uh, do something, and uh, they they block Instagram. So you know, I'm kind of thinking that anything can be blocked again, like it happened before. You know, it did. Anyway, this is the perfect place to fill containers with water or to be hit by lightning. Only oily water comes out of the tap. Oh, great. Broken transmitter. We got the broken transmitter now. Let's try using it on us. I don't need Doc's help to repair this thing. You're gonna do it yourself? I do oh, oops. Um, on the other hand, it wouldn't hurt him to help out a little bit. What did you do? Nothing. I managed to... This tort all the missing... I don't need Doc... Okay. I do... Oh. Um, I don't need. All right. I d um. Hey, goal. Everything okay? Boring. What are we doing here anyway? Don't worry. It's all part of the plan. So much thunder in the air. <laughs> don't pee your pants. The chances of being struck by lightning are about as high as winning the lottery. Dak. <laughs> Statistics are for people who don't want to take any risks. <laughs> True. So how are we going to get this radio mast repaired? Why are you asking me? You're supposed to be the tinkerer here. Well, I am. Oh, really? Then what's broken? Well, uh, <laughs> the, the, the thingies here are, are uh, really loose. And, and the, the, the electric um, shoes are, are, are mislaced and have, have an electric double knot on the, uh, <laughs> the uh, electro loop. <laughs> I found the problem. The transmitter is broken. Then what are we waiting for? Off to dock with it. Why, Doc? I'm a tinkerer too. And I always thought you could only break things. Hey, watch out, or I'm gonna break your heart. Again? 
I've got a plan. Can you stand on that plateau over there for a minute? Well, why not? What could possibly be wrong with standing on an elevated platform in a thunderstorm? So you'll do it? Heavens no! How naive do you think I am? Ah, Next, but... I'm going to put a bucket of water there for my feet. Ah. Or hand me an umbrella. Ah. Just, just a moment. Ah. <laughs> well, umbrella. you asked You're for it. You're planning to use me as a human lightning rod, are you? No, I wouldn't dream of it. Well, not Wait, you. Wouldn't dream of it. But when you're awake... Too late. Drat. Okay. On we go. I hope you know what you're doing. Absolutely. Well then, let's do it. Ooh, okay. Nice. Oh. Oh. Well, you may not be naive. But the baby go should do the trick. B -b -b baby go. Hey go. Everything okay? Not really. I'm afraid of them. I'm here. All is well. So much thunder in the air. Yes. How do you manage to stay so calm? Well, once you've stuck your fingers into the same electrical socket three times in a row, then, then, then you, you still know how you started sentences, even if you... <laughs> Snibbly bubbly whoop. I have so much to learn from you. Dear wobble the snow. So how are we going to get this radio mask prepared? Oh, dear. I don't know anything about that. Ah, oh, don't take it hard. Yeah, you aren't a universal yeah, genius yeah. like me. I must be an unbelievable disappointment to you. No, oh, I wouldn't say unbelievable. But you know what? From now on, I'll just watch everything you do very closely. Since you always know what to do, that way I'll learn very quickly. Oh, exactly. I'll try to take notes That's what of the... everything. Huh, super. That would be the start yeah. of a series no. of series. Stand mistakes. around and tremble. I never would have thought of that. All right, uh, before we continue. Oh, I forgot to start the timer. Well, that's cool. Now I'm gonna have to keep it running through the remaining ads as well. Uh, which one of them is coming up right now? So if you're not the sub, you may get ads for up to three minutes or so. But we'll be waiting. I shall see you after that. We have boosts. Okay, we have we have surprisingly low amount of boosts today. That's fine though. Not the timer. Yeah, yeah. Starving underscore yes, drummer just timer. boosted Fallout Three. Life giving water. Starving I underscore kept... drummer just boosted Dagger Fall. Starving Fall. underscore drummer just boosted Scald. Scald. Babylon Zool just boosted BG Three. Hey Zool. Babylon Zool just boosted Wasteland. Hello, Zul. Welcome. Babylon Zool just boosted Scald. Scald, hell yeah. Tony 68K just boosted Eye of Beholder. Oh, Tony Good to 68K to you. just boosted great. Mass Effect 3. Tony 68K just tooted Fallout 3. There we go. Thank you for the boosts. Uh, drummer, Zul, Tony. Your sound card works perfectly. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the channel. Always a pleasure to be here. Always a pleasure to see you. So, how are you doing? How is your Tuesday? Oh no! Uh, <laughs> did I not show you the boosts? I was I was boosting as you were, as you were boosting. I was boosting in tandem. You know, in rhythm. With you. I was, I really was. And I did I forget to show it? I'm I'm doing great today. Uh, I'm forgetting to start the timers. I am starting them as I go into the ads as as opposed to stopping them during ad breaks. And then I don't show the boosts as I do the boosts. That it's it's been amazing. New critical hits nomination. Did well? How goes it for just you? Just nominated Dragon Quest great. Eleven. Uh, the game has been going great. We made some good progress today. We, um, we have solved some tough puzzles that we couldn't last week. 
and the story is coming along nicely. We actually finished the chapter. So I've, I've been having a great time with this game. So Dragon Quest XI. Um, I don't know what that game is. Let's see what that is. Dragon Quest XI. Dragon Quest XI. Echoes of an Elusive Age. First of all, I tend to not play games that are not first in a series. Like, I would like to play from the first game. So starting at an 11th game isn't really something I do. So uh, that's, that's one. The second thing is I, I don't play JRPGs usually. Uh, there are a few JRPGs on the lists. I am not a fan of JRPGs. The JRPGs on the lists list are... Uh, you know, if they get selected and if I play them, and if then I enjoy them, only then I will start allowing more JRPGs onto the list. So I, I am not allowing any more JRPGs onto the list right now. So those are two very big reasons that I cannot accept that nomination. I'm sorry. But I don't think I would start from the 11th game anyway. You know. Played Yakuza like a dragon right before DQ11, so by the end of it, you were real tired of that. When Quest 1 is 38 years old, you wouldn't recommend it. So uh, sometimes I do break series into uh, groups, like uh, like Ultima series, I broke into three groups. 1, 2, 3, uh, 4, 5, 6, and 7, 8, 9. Basically three trilogies. I did the same for Might and Magic. Um, 1, 2, 3, then 4, 5, which is a single game you know, a combined game called World of Zine, and then 6, 7, 8, 9. So if there is a good uh, way to divide the game, divide the series into different groups, I could definitely consider that. Uh, but then again, uh, being JRPG, I wouldn't admit this into the list anyway. There are a few JRPGs. If you're a JRPG fan, uh, you sh you might consider supporting some of these uh, more, you know, more regularly supported JRPGs such as Chrono Trigger is here, pretty high on the lists, and Shining Force is here, that gets some uh, support occasionally. Undertale, not really being a JRPG, it is similar to a JRPG, you know, in some ways, at least gameplay wise, so it's there. Uh, and Acronox kind of has JRPG combat style, it is there. And uh, what else? Knights of Pen and Paper. Ayudan, Ayudan Chronicle is is a thing. Ayudan Chronicle is a thing that I allowed into the system. We did a sponsored stream of this. I had a good time, so I I thought why not. Then there is this um, Battle Chasers, So Saves the World, Delta Rune, which didn't really come out yet. There is Final Fantasy. I don't have them yet, but they are in the list, so you could boost them. Final Fantasy one through six. Dragon's Dogma, yes. Dragon's Dogma have been, have been put forward several times. I refused it every single time, dude, because it's just uh, too much action for me. I I wouldn't, I wouldn't enjoy that game uh, as much as a lot of people do. It's just not really my kind of game. I know it has RPG elements, uh, but I think it's too much action for me. Long games are not precluded. Thank goodness. Uh, not yet. The candles play very well. They are all very long games, probably not super suitable for streaming. Oh, uh, sorry, I misunderstood what you were saying, Vero. Yeah, I don't. I have no problem playing long games as long as it's a game that I will enjoy. Like I'm not going to suffer through 200 hours of uh, a boring game. Thankfully, it has never happened. Like the longest game we have played is Pathfinder Kingmaker, which I enjoyed every second of for 135 hours. So I don't necessarily have it problem with length more uh, if a game is not something I would enjoy I found the problem the transmitter come back from the is broken oh dear if you got I any. hope Doc can repair it why Doc? I'm a tinkerer too oh <laughs> I quite forgot that I keep getting hit by lightning you poor thing. Why are the best always plagued by bad luck? 
<laughs> a very good question. I wish I could help you somehow, but the only thing I can think of are a couple of silly rules on how to behave in a thunderstorm. And I'm sure you already know them, as clever as you are. Uh, exactly. What sort of rules? The rules on how to behave in a thunderstorm? Oh, <laughs> you're just making fun of me. Every child knows them. I know them too, but I feel responsible for you, so I have to be sure you know them too. Oh, that's so sweet. Well, never be in water during a thunderstorm. Also, never stand under a tree. Willows are especially dangerous. And finally, don't hold an open umbrella. So, water, tree, umbrella. And then you get hit by lightning, right? Not really. Even if you do all these things at once, the chances of being struck by lightning are still very small. Winning the lottery is almost more likely. Hmm. Water, tree, umbrella, lottery. Oh, that should be everything. <laughs> lottery. Okay. I've got a plan. Can you stand on that plateau over there for a minute? Of course. And now? Hmm. For some reason, that's not working. Come back down for now. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. On we go. I'll follow you anywhere. Okay. So on the plateau, we need to... We need to get some water. So that she can step in it. We need to give her an umbrella. We need to plant a tree and wait for it to grow. Uh, maybe not. There's a pump here. Maybe we can put somewhere in there. This is the perfect place to fill containers with water or to be hit by lightning. Yes, so uh, the shoe could be a container. This is the perfect order to be hit by lightning. But it is a conceivably stupid place to store my junk. There's already enough water in this shoe, and that in spite of all the holes. Um... How about now I can finally wash a brush my yeah, water? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Only oily water comes out of the tap. Oh, great. I... I don't know if we can do anything here right now. Possibly not. Let's try this. I went to the radio mast. The transmitter is broken. How do you know? Oh, I found it lying at the foot of the radio antenna. It's fried. So it is. You're right. Oh, I know a fried piece of electronics when I see one. Even when your signature is missing? Can you repair it? I already did. Well, why did you take so long? <laughs> Mainly because of the lollipop stick that was stuck between the contacts. At any rate, the device is working now. All you need to do is mount it at the top of the radio mast. Easy peasy. All right. We are, I don't think we can do it. So let's go to the final place. See. Wait. Why is there a hand icon constantly? Interesting. So, that's Porta Fisco, the former metropolis of the Rust Red Sea. A real dump, even by Deponian standards. And what is that awful stench? All right, we go back. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? Of course. Ah, found any trace of that sub... I'm working... I can't get up the radio mast. Can't help you there, I'm afraid. I've been working on a remedy for flat feet for years, but I can't get my hands on enough donated organs. My feet aren't flat. It's the lightning. Every time I climb the mast, one of those meteorological bullies shows up and knocks me over the head. Every time? You're more likely to win the lottery. <laughs> that would be more fun. Have you ever been to Porta Fisco? <laughs> More than once, but it's barely worth the trip these days. The Organon has occupied the center of town, and the residents of the slums outside the city gates can't afford neurosurgical procedures. Those poor wretches. 
I'll carry on then. Keep me posted. You never played any of these Deponia games? You need to put it higher on the list. They have excellent puzzles. So Actually, I think you would have a good time with these. Would be Captain. Yeah, we fur. Questionable humor, some questionable writing, definitely very questionable actions by the protagonists, but you know, the story and the puzzles are excellent. What do you know about Porta Fisco? Only that it used to be the largest and most important city on the Rust Red Sea. But nowadays, it's scarcely more than ruins. Ruins? <laughs> the Organon occupies the entire city. The Dark Exchequer guards the Ascension Customs in the center of town. In the center of... yeah, that's, that's good. <laughs> that's where they say the last high boat to Elysium is anchored, too. The former residents of the town all live in slums outside the gates. Outside the gate? Oh, that's good. You're not even listening, are you? You're just repeating the last words. The last words are, yeah, I'm repeating them. <laughs> They're always the best. Yeah. It's more because it was written at a time where people didn't think words and action could result in people getting hurt or offended. Um, Back to work, sailor! Was it though? But I am the, uh, 2012 no isn't that old. But I'm, I'm not just talking about not being politically correct. I'm, I'm only talking about, you know, I'm, well, not only, but mostly talking about the actions taken by the protagonist. I feel kind of bad being the conduit, uh, even if this is a game. Like, some, some parts of the game were uh, truly uncomfortable for me, uh, having to cause Rufus to do what it does while playing the game. Transition also makes it a little worse. Pun quality suffers. I, I bet that is that is also a problem. The game originally being in German. There are only a couple of spots in in the first two games where I felt truly uh, annoyed with things. You know, one of the things being making that bird suffer in the right after the tutorial part of the second game. I, I was truly uncomfortable with that scene, for example. Most of the time, it's just Rufus being a douche and annoying. And it's okay. You know, we all know he's like that. It's no problem to me. And the words and writing, you know, those some of the words that could be considered politically incorrect and offensive. Uh, I just take it as part of Rufus's character and the game's writing. And uh, I'm, I'm not really you know, annoyed too much by their existence. They don't particularly worry me. I said before, this character is like the exaggerated version of Guybrush Tripwood who also does anything to get his way. But Rufus fully embraces that strategy, you know, hurt everything around you, exploit everyone around you, and get what you want. And he says it openly. That's the only thing that I'm a little bit annoyed with. Alright. Power Inverter. A blast from the past. Oh, that reminds me of my superb trick with the field kitchen. Hey, Goal. Everything okay? And how? Isn't it fantastic here? <laughs> yeah, well, if you're into squalor. I think it's wonderful. <laughs> There's the woman with brain damage. <laughs> What's that funky smell? I hope it isn't me. Ripping is all the no, sarcasm when it comes to jokes anyway. Which there. for some causes can be so difficult on Well, true. But I must smell terrible. I haven't brushed my teeth today. And if you don't do that three times a day, bacteria will form in your mouth. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, whatever. And on weekends, they meet with the Yeti and put addictive substances into adhesives. But there are addictive substances in adhesives. Oh, poor goal. Poor gullible goal. I wonder who lives in that tent up there. <gasps> Probably a great magician. Great magicians don't live in tents. Don't they live on any the game junk content skipper's unless stroller. actually trying to spread wow. fascism. No, no, there's nothing like that, of course. <laughs> there's nothing like Magic. that, of course. As I said, I, I don't think it's it's really fair to get offended for, uh, you know, the, the humor can be offensive, 
But this game, it's not that bad. At least the first two games. I have heard it kind of gets somewhat racist with stereotypical, uh, you know, making fun of stereo stereotypes of people in the later games. I, I haven't seen that yet. Uh, you know, that could be somewhat uh, offensive. So far, I haven't really seen anything that's exceptionally offensive in terms of the game's writing. Older games that have edgy humor too. Never look at them through the lens of today. Same with movies. Yeah, exactly. It was just a very stereotypic view of women, love and sex. I th I don't think it says it's just about women, love and sex. It's it's about everything. There is only one rule for Rufus. Uh, it has to it has to serve him. Anything it, he does has to serve him, and there is no regard for anything else that includes exploiting women as well animals or anyone else or the environment the plants you know everything just one rule you could argue that it's best sexism rufus is obviously written as a douche in those situations exactly uh, exactly that's what i'm saying it, rufus can be a sexist person from the way he acts uh, but I don't think the game spreads sexism or anything like that. The game doesn't spread hate or racism or anything. Rufus can be all of those things or none of those things, but the game doesn't spread any of it. The game clearly sh puts Rufus in the, in the shoes at best of an anti-hero and a terrible person. You know, e every other NPC calls Rufus for what he is. Everyone says why he is bad. He is a bad person. So no one says Rufus is great. A few people that stop playing is due to the stereotyping. It has a lot of issues. I understand. I wouldn't stop because of that, unless it got really worse, which I don't think it does. No sign of Donna Gold. It's actually frustrating. We can is do this. Did I ever say anything? <laughs> I don't think very... this is this has anything to do with. But the developers' no sense real um, yeah, frustrations or feelings or anything. They created this fantastic character you know, called Rufus, who is the biggest douchebag ever created on an adventure game. Out. And they just went with it. They went to town with it. It's one of the crea characters they created. Nothing more than that. On we go. I'll follow you anywhere. Come in, Rufus. I have been expecting you. Excellent. My reputation precedes me. Not at all. The crystal ball. Tell me of your arrival. And it even knows my name? Actually, I heard you humming your name in the entrance. But no matter. You are late, Rufus. I will tell that. <laughs> yeah, all right. that's, that's fair. Content, that's fair. Which, strictly speaking, makes no sense. One more thing. I am going Sorry, to I misunderstood you. So. That you stealing my bananas. Are are you some sort of psychic? I possess the third eye. Yes, but I don't practice anymore. Then I dumped the coffee grounds on the carpet in the ante room for nothing? Well, times have changed. Today, if you don't want to end up getting burnt at the stake, you're better off keeping dark forebodings to yourself. That's why I switch to couples. Couch. Music is really good. Yeah. Say what? You foresaw that you would foresee bad times, and so you gave up fortune telling? But but no, I give up my job in time. Therefore, I will never foresee bad times. And what will never happen cannot be foreseen. However, I did foresee that I would give up my job for this reason. Uh, I kind of wish I was back with Doc's time anomalies. You do couples counseling now? Yes. For some reason, people are more receptive to bad news when it comes to their relationships. Can you predict the lottery numbers? I could. Oh, come on. Tell me the lottery numbers. No. Will I succeed in saving the world? The future is not yet written, Rufus, except in my journal, of course. I will be very busy next month, 
so I get a little ahead of myself. Why do you live in a tent? My customers expect a mystical ambience. It is also practical. In the event of a catastrophe, I can pack all my belongings together in a matter of minutes. W wait what sort of catastrophe? Oops. Um, the fabric <laughs> of time is in constant motion. A veil lies across the future. No, tell me about the catastrophe. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uncertainty plays naked on the bongos. There is no gasoline for Satinav's chainsaw. Ooh. Wait, this is wrong hey, game. don't change the subject. What sort of catastrophe? Ooh. <sighs> Darn it. Okay. I don't want your bananas. You will steal them nevertheless. Believe me. I really don't want your bananas. <sighs> Boring. Resign yourself to the inevitable and take the bananas already. They are tasty. Luscious banana. I don't want to bother you any longer. I have seen it otherwise. Banana, you say? Mm. Ah. It is time. The time of the great banana heist has come, as was foreseen. You underestimate me. I can fight it. Don't fight it. Don't fight it. You know you want Go the banana. On. Accept your fate. No, never. Yes, pick Go it up. On. Take them. Help yourself. No. <laughs> yes. Wow, ah, all of them. Ah, that's the way. Submit to your fate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so Rufus. Cool. Now they're bending in the other direction. Ah, you idiot. I'm sensing negative vibrations. Unfortunately, Doc hasn't invented a remote for that, lazy bum. The most is old, but that wasn't real. It was a matter of I managed to this to all the and fit. It may, but, <laughs> but, I'm sensing neck. I'm sent. Unfortunately, the most is. But it was. Uh, hmm. Which, oh, wait. Hmm. A dead fish swims with the stream, which means, huh, still dead. Oh, <laughs> I've revived enough fish for today. This torch fall the without power. Without power. Right. Mm, what else? Let's talk to the guy again. I see that you have more questions. Ha! Totally wrong. But since we're here, I actually I don't wanna... don't. I have. Burning barrel. Could he burn something there? Burn the torch. Light up the torch. <laughs> Rufus have fire! Wow. <gasps> have you gotta keep it burning? Hey, go! Everything. And oh, I don't want to talk to. Oh. You coming with me to the fortune teller? He lives in the tent. Ah, fortune teller! Wow! What are we waiting for? Last one, there's a rotten egg. Next year already? So it is written. It's because of the head. Heralds need to breathe too. Oh, there he is. Hey, what were you two talking about? Nothing. Let us begin. So, were they talking about want? Rufus losing his hair? Because he has been keeping the hat on? Next year? Ah. And uh, what are this week's lottery numbers? I don't understand what this has to do with your relationship. This is couples counseling. I only answer questions relating to your partnership. Oh yeah, let me rephrase that. Will we be rich? Lottery winner rich? This is a trick? Huh? No. Well. All right. <laughs> I'll see if I can perceive anything in the ball. I see. 
that you will be rich. Oh yeah, I knew it! Rich in experience. Provided you survive all this. Ah, <gasps> what more can one wish for? <laughs> A tip on the lottery numbers, maybe? That was interesting. But the ball today, will say Bano. no more. Here of FPS games with answers of necromancy, devil daggers would be a good pick. Chasm is an excellent Metroidvania with a daily challenge down. That sounds really interesting. Dude. Certainly good for someone who's interested in those games. What is the what is the cost? How do I prevent Goal from marrying Cletus? What? You aren't a couple? Let me rephrase that. What does our future together look like? Tricky. I should ask the ball. I see. That you still have a long, difficult path before you. Before us? Don't you mean behind us? Are you holding the ball the right way around? Um, I think so. At any rate, there is an arrow on the bottom. This <laughs> side up, it says here. So there's still a long road ahead of us. That's great, as long as we're together. <laughs> Rufus isn't happy. Five games for less than a dollar each. Oh, that's not bad at all. It's a bargain. Will we find Donna Goal in time? I don't understand what this has to do with your relationship. Let me rephrase that. Will Goal and I ever really get together? A good question. I see. You will undergo painful changes. Before you get together, you both must first come to terms with yourselves. Wow! Have you ever thought about selling embroidered pillows? They would sell like hotcakes! Got to do some pre-course reading before but All right, there. Enjoy your reading. And um, eventually, enjoy your night and sleep as well. Thanks for being here. I'll see you next time. Are we going to survive all this? I don't understand what this has to do with your relationship. But let me rephrase that. What does the future hold for our health? I see. Oh my goodness. That is terrible. How can anyone survive that? What? What do you see? <sighs> you don't want to know. Believe me. I must urgently advise you to stay as far away from each other as possible. Never! We will always be there for each other, won't we, Rufus? What will happen to Deponia? I don't understand what... All right. But let me... Where will we grow old together? On Elysium? Well, that should be simple to answer. Huh? What's wrong? The ball suddenly went dark. Very strange. <laughs> that must be because the ball is showing scenes that aren't suitable for youngsters. Or oh, we're taking a romantic walk at night. In any case, it's a good sign. I'm sure of it. Okay. Ah, this is all humbug. You're holding the ball upside down. I'm afraid not. Here, you are welcome to take a look for yourself. I think I'm supposed to... Uh, power inverter? I see you are planning to haggle over your fate. But as honorable as the attempt to alter your predestined path may be, fate cannot be bribed, my friend. Can I take it from him? Remote? I see you are but fate. Shh! 
Ouch! I want to know what happens next. Yeah, yeah, I believe you. No, 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 I don't know. I don't believe you. But it's looking Let's continue. You somehow have to change the... I see your fate. How could we do that? It's not an object. Maybe we don't have what we need. I saw. I saw fate. These won't work. I saw. I saw. I saw. I saw. I mean, the only thing that makes kind of sense I is saw. power immersion. I saw. Yeah, yeah. Let's continue. Let you know what? Let's end the session. This isn't getting us anywhere. Oh, too bad. Come back once you've reconsidered. Can we bring the sports in ball? She probably wouldn't agree to go into couples counseling with us. Hey, Goal. Everything else. I'm, didn't you promise me advice? I didn't make any promises. I actually meant to keep. <laughs> What's that funky smell? I hope it isn't you. No, I think it's coming from that guy over there. That's what I would have said in your place. Yeah, to distract suspicion away from you. Why should I? I smell fantastic. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? <coughs> It's yeah, that yeah, it's, it's that bum Subject over there, closed. no doubt. <laughs> you coming with me to the fortune teller? He lives no, you in the tent. A fortune teller? No way, forget it. Why should I let some random imposter tell me where I'm going? Hey, I don't believe in that stuff either. I meant you. Oh. <laughs> no sign of Donna Goal. You are Ishraf really just making much of an effort, are you? Hey, Ishraf I'm saving my energy for skull. upcoming challenges. And what if the challenges don't come? Trust me, Ishraf they're just on their way. They're mad for a surprise trash. attack. In the end, all our plans will be foiled, and nothing but an extremely risky coup can save us. And it always works like that? Every time. Cool. On we uh, go. I Only hope you baby. know what you're doing. Only baby girl comes with us to the fortune tell. Well, we can go this way. Um, let's talk to Dean first. You're really sleepy today? Me too, for some reason. Well, I don't really feel sleepy, but I keep yawning. Hey there, uh, I'm not sure why. Advantage contemporary? Uh, is that necessary? Why? Isn't that the politically correct term? Maybe it's because I it's Tuesday. I especially didn't say rancid bum, although it was very tempting. My name is Goon, and if you want to make fun of the homeless, you're in the wrong place. Hey, don't worry. I'm a friend of the little guy. The little guy? Yeah, his name is Wenzel. I have no <laughs> idea what you're talking about. Oh, yeah. Oh, is that I almost a... forgotten. The lower classes is don't that an the language of the educated elite. Fortunately, I'm well versed in ghetto slang. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. Please don't do that. Hey ho, my brother. What's up in the hood? Please stop that. I haven't always lived on the street. I'm an academic. Oh, yeah. Now I understand. This is some sort of uh, social experiment, right? You've disguised yourself as a tramp in order to study their customs. Um, precisely. <laughs> Very clever. I almost fell for it, but not, not quite. I will admit, your stink is authentic. But as far as your behavior goes, there's a lot to improve. I'm very familiar with the habits of the average hobo. I could uh, teach you a few things if you'll answer oh, really? a couple of questions in return. But no, no objection. I insist. Okay. You look hungry. I am. For months, I've been living off the algae that grow on the key wall. My gums are bleeding, but what else can I do? 
<laughs> I see you're making an effort, but <clears throat> just because it's pathetic, that doesn't make it, you know, bum style. So, so what do bums eat? Whatever they can find, I'm afraid. No, 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 wrong. Last week, I even nibbled off the scabs from a discarded bandage. <laughs> no, 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 no. I said wrong. No, bums eat shoes. What? Shoes. Everyone knows that. Major. Bombs eat shoes? Are you still hungry? Yes. Do you have anything for me to eat? <laughs> now that's the way I like it. Begging is very authentic. But I'm really, really hungry. No, 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 don't overdo it. First, internalize this lesson. Okay, I'll explain how to eat a shoe later. Oh, what is that horrible smell? Oh, how insensitive of me. <laughs> That's you. <laughs> don't you think you're overdoing it a bit? <laughs> Very funny. You don't exactly smell of orchids yourself. Hey, stay in character, okay? A bum like you doesn't even know what, what, what orchidelias are. So keep it cool, okay? Is that your umbrella? Hey, hands off. It's the only thing I still own. The weather here on the quay can sometimes be quite unpleasant. Now, don't worry, I'm not going to take it away from you. I'm just going to make a couple of modifications. It just, it looks too new. You think so? Even though it was struck by lightning the other day? <laughs> there, that should do. But now it won't protect me from the rain at all. Yeah, don't be so ungrateful. I'm helping you stay in character. Can I borrow your umbrella? Are you crazy? First you break it, and now you want to take it away from me? Well, if it's broken, then what do you need it for? As a, a prop for my role. Okay, okay. How about a deal? I'll give you something to eat, and you give me the umbrella. Agreed? You... you would really do that for me? Of course. I told you I was a philanthropist. Unbelievable. We could practice a little freestyling. As a resident of the ghetto, you only have to master one instrument, the beatbox. Beatbox? It's very simple. Like this. Oom, a choo. Oom, oom, a choo. Oom, a choo. And now, you. Oom, a choo. Oom, oom, a choo. Rufus got the groove. Rufus got the groove, yeah. Who's cooler than a platypus in hibernation? Who kicks ass in any situation? Who makes ladies faint and shriek? Can't be copied, he's unique. It's Rufus. Yeah, yeah, Rufus. Who's got style? Who is cooler? Who can fool her? Who's the ruler? Who is daring, never queasy? Who will soon be in Elysee? Um, Rufus. Yeah, yeah, Rufus. Hey, 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 what? What, huh? What's that supposed to be? Well, I thought I'd build in a break. You know, that's not thinking. That's pushing yourself into the spotlight. I mean, apparently there's no point in trying to teach you to freestyle. <laughs> Too bad that was one cool song, you bum. <laughs> It wasn't very good fat meat season material. There was only one uh, set of bars. And it doesn't fit the other ones, I think. Can I have the umbrella? Did no, yeah, I, I you didn't happen to see a submersible go by here. No, sorry. It was I good left my snorkeling gear in my winter house. Oh, that's a pity. Oh, wait a minute. You don't have a winter home. That was sarcasm. <laughs> You're quick on the uptake. Yeah, okay. No more sarcasm. All right, bums. Don't use sarcasm. What do you mean they don't? Can you tell me a few things about Portofisco? Certainly. What would you like to know? How do I get to the Upper Ascension Station? You can't. The Organon has sealed off all the routes to the Ascension Customs. Do you know where I can find the Rebels' secret hideout? Huh? Sure. The entrance is right here in the sewers. No, no, I meant the secret hideout. I only know this one here. Isn't Porta Fisco also an Organon settlement? It's even their central headquarters. Ulysses has his office right by the Ascension Customs of the Upper Ascension Station. It's always been the Organon's job to keep the Deponians away from the high boats. Now there's only one left, and they say it will be leaving the planet very soon. Who knows? Maybe then the Organon will finally disappear from Porta Fisco. 
and then the Bonya will find will make a great leap here upwards. Yeah, more than the face of the universe. Uh, pardon me. Yeah, it's uh, b boring, I think. Yeah. I can't say I found the story all that boring. Okay, let's change the subject. This place is somehow depressing. Yes, yes, I, I can understand that. Uh, Porto Fisco has depressed me my whole life long. Yes, but you aren't that important, so it isn't as bad for you. Smell you later. And remember what I taught you. Sure thing, my brother. Oh, and, uh, okay, wait, 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 wait. One more tip. Nobody likes a smart ass. Here's some food for you. I think I might have something for you to eat. Really? Wow, I don't know what to say. No, 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 not so fast. I want to suggest a trade. I'll give you the food, and you give me your umbrella. Uh, I don't know. It's the only thing I still own. Oh, yum, 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 yum. Yummy food. Oh, all right. Agreed. Hey, wait a minute. That's just a broken shoe. Exactly. The appropriate food for a tramp like you. What? But, but that's... No, no, no. Thank me later. Bon appetit. Unfortunately, Doc had reason. Why should I burn with so much nice stuff to burn? <laughs> that would be really funny. But as long as there's still a chance that I'll think of something funnier, we'll consider that... Plan A.5. Without power, I can't... I'm sensing negative... I managed to... It may look like, but in reality... If this is... A... Alright. Can't do anything with the umbrella just yet. Uh, let's go to the resistance place. Hey, you coming? Go? What a waste. That could have been turned into a fantastic escape mechanism. Or a high-speed cheese grater. Hmm. Cheese. Uh, well, this could be the only it thing fits. that goes there, right? Hmm. Hey, Mason, you've been derping in the last 30 minutes, you think? Good to see you, Mason. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a good Tuesday. You like cheese? Okay, it needs gas as well, so... Uh... All right, uh, we need to siphon the gas from um, Isla Watch It. I love cheese pie. I love hmm. cheese. Tired, I'm waiting to send something back. Yes, it's me, Rufus. No, it's not. If you were Rufus, you'd know the secret knock. I know it. It uh, starts with N, right? Ha. Good luck. Oh, uh, hmm. Hmm? What? Uh, b b b what? Plus, minus, plus? So, wh what are some alternatives? What if... Wrong, but... Wrong. Blast it! Hmm. Is there a wait option that I... am not finding? Well, uh, let's use this. Plus minus plus, is this supposed to be a code? One thing's for certain, these knock puzzles get dumber by the minutes. Rufus can nap up to f an up to five times until Leobald Dylan traps him. Can you figure out the cap pattern of Leobald's answers? What? Wrong, but wrong. Blast it! Wrong, wrong. What does it even mean? So if I do it six times? Wrong, but wrong. 
lost it. If I do it five times and go. Oh, wait, what was that? Wrong, but wrong. Blast it. <laughs> okay, wait, what what was this? Five and go. Three. Wrong, but wrong. Blast it. I one. One. Is this a bug? Wrong, but wrong. Is this a weird bug that happening? It's not a clue, right? Wrong, but wrong. Blast it. I, I don't get it at all. Wrong, but wrong. Blast it. Okay, I, I don't understand. I don't understand if there is something I'm not seeing in this puzzle or if this is also bugged. What? No, no, no. Uh, don't solve it for me. We, we will come back to this later. Um, let's go somewhere else. If you are familiar with my puzzle, uh, with with that with my puzzle, if you are familiar with that puzzle, I'd be, I'd be glad to learn, uh, if that puzzle is functioning properly or not. Because there's a good chance I'm not understanding it, but there's a, there's a little bit of a chance that it's bugged, like last time, because it's behaving strange. Hey, goal. Everything okay? I'm Okay, goal isn't coming here either. These tires are worn out and boring, but if they were burning, hmm. somewhere back there, the last high boat to Elysium is at anchor. What's better than a mountain of tires? Right, a mountain of burning tires. <laughs> Somewhere back there, Ulysses is preparing the destruction of Deponia with a well-aimed toss. I could probably knock him off his Organon office chair, but I want to look him in the eye and beg for mercy. Okay. I'm sure I'll find a way to the other side. Unfortunately, I have other problems at the moment. You got lucky, Organon. Looks like the Organon I would call. Unfortunately, you got lucky. Somewhere back there. Ouch! Ah, this isn't gonna work. You got a burning tire. Go to key. Burning tire. Hmm. Okay, let's go somewhere else. I don't know what to do then. Maybe we can put this thing out with bananas now, like I planned in the first area. That isn't the exhaust pipe. <laughs> wow. <laughs> the good old banana in the exhaust trick. <laughs> Rufus actually gives you the solution to this puzzle in the first area, and I thought we would we would stop the diesel generator in the first area by putting a banana, you know, straightening a banana. It didn't work then. Here's a tank for diesel, but without tools, I can't get it out. It works here, though, which is amazing. I should be able to siphon off some diesel with that. But into what container? Did you drink it? Uh, 
Yum. <laughs> Tasty. Now I need to hurry and find a proper container. It's all running into the sea. Container? Let's see if there's still enough. De yep. Boa, you should always hedge your bets. I don't have a container for that. I'm not here to put out the fire. Quite the contrary. After all, we are in the middle of a rebellion. This is the perfect place to fill containers with water or to be hit by lightning. But it is a conceit. Okay. I've got a plan. Can you? Well, of course. why not? What could possibly be wrong with standing on an elevator? Next, you're going to put a bucket of water or hand. Rufus, just a. You aren't planning. <laughs> All right. Wait. Too late. Drat. Okay. I gotta have the baby. Ba -ba -ba baby goal. Ba -ba -ba baby goal. I've got a plan. Of course. And now? Now, you take this umbrella. Hmm. For some reason, that's not working. Come back down for now. Well, there are other things we need to do. We need to put water under her feet, and we need to win the we need to win the lottery as well. There's a bunch of things to do still. <clears throat> What is the next move? Water process. Would this work? He invented the wheel and fire, but he never had the idea of combining the two. No, it didn't work. Signs are useless. They don't even burn. Not even when they have flames painted on them. Water posts. There's a bow. <laughs> Bozo's trawler would see him. I'll keep that idea in the back. <laughs> I'll keep. Oh, crap. No one. I'm not sure if we can do anything here. In black market, we need. We need tuna, right? For the cats. How's it going? Get low. Go ahead. Keep fishing, you ninny. Not till you go away. Go ahead. Not. I've had it. <laughs> I'll wow. I dropped banana. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty. Look what yummies I have here. Huh, the cat doesn't seem to. How sad. It probably. Then it can't. I can help. Stop. Uh. Yeah, I said. Okay. I managed to hook. You know, if we get some banana puree, add the fish inside the puree. It may look like tuna. Would the cat be able to tell the difference? Probably. Been getting bad buffering, low video quality, and rubber banding for a while. Might not be a short hiccup for you after all. Ah. Uh. I don't know if there's something wrong with the... I mean, I did drop some frames. Not much. And I, I don't continue to. So... There may be a problem with the connection. I don't know. I'll watch it. I feel very stuck at the moment. Swords for everyone! Hey, maniacal! Welcome. This is the perfect place to fill containers. Welcome. And water. Actually, I will not stop the timer. But welcome, Ale. Insert raid message. To store my junk. Welcome, everybody. Maniacal, thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? Let me snooze these ads. There, we were about to get some ads. 
evil sneeze dumb. Let's give you a shout out. Welcome everybody. Did the do you not have any clips? Is the clip thing not working? I'm not sure. So you are having stuttering issues on a few channels, different times. How are you, man, Michael? How are you, Eil? How was the stream? Oh, there we go. Is this Sea of Thieves? Where there is no sky. But that was a very sharp intake of breath. I just heard an explosion. Your sound card works perfectly. Thank you for the follow. Welcome. Welcome to the channel. No. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> You don't sound fine. Thank you so much for the raid. Good to see you all. So what were you playing today? Let's see. You were playing Caves of Cod. How are you enjoying Caves of Cod? Are you finding many ways to die? Uh, what kind of a character do you have? And are you still alive? Welcome everyone. I'm Mitral. I play lots of RPGs and points and click adventures. We are playing the Ponya, the second game in the series. I'm completely stuck. I have absolutely no idea what to do next. Uh, we are sailing back and forth between four islands with a few scenes, trying to figure out what to do. Hope you enjoy your time here. Hope you have a good time. But yeah, tell me about the maniacal stream. How did it go? Also, how are you, Ale? Hope you are doing great. This is the perfect place to fill containers. Hope you are having a good Tuesday. Or to be hit by lightning. But it is... A okay, um... Um, I don't know. Bait fish. Pump. So what? What are we supposed There's to do no with need. this pump? I want to board a submersible or whatever it is that you need. Uh, it has oily water coming out, right? It's not a random daily challenges from a few days back, turning into your best run ever. Oh, really? So you are having a successful and fun run. What kind of a character? Is it? Yesterday you ate your hands, and today you made an axe wielding troll fall in love with you twice. Yesterday you ate your hand. Okay. Well, that's that's really interesting. <laughs> really interesting. Okay. You're doing good. Just a bit tired. Been hitting the forge hard. Oh, really? It's it's smithing time. Yeah. What are you making? Are you making something specific or just? You know, trying to take out your frustrations by beating some metal. Um, I bet you are making some cool blade or something, if I had to guess. I'm doing alright. I'm having a good time with this game. Uh, for the most part. Some puzzles are excellent. And we have made good progress, but now I feel utterly stuck, so... I'm not sure what to do next. We have had one bug one puzzle glitch out on us in the past there is one more puzzle um that i suspect that i worry might be bugging right now now that is no one has really confirmed that it is indeed buggy or if it if it works uh properly like it's supposed to i feel like it's it doesn't like it acts in a weird way is if it's bugged, but I, I cannot be certain. This being my blind playthrough, so. Yesterday, oh, I, I think I read that. Yeah, I read that. So it would be nice if someone who knows the game could tell me if that puzzle is indeed bugged or not bugged at all, that I'm being paranoid. I've been working on some knives and a hairpin. The one knife is done, has been delivered. The other one still needs a handle. We just need to pretty up the hairpin a little. Hairpin is in something very small that you would put to tie your hair, you know, st stick your hair together after it's tied. Your sound card works perfectly. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the channel. Hope you enjoy the stream. Or, or is it like... Um, Something you would use to pick a lock, because I believe those are also called hairpins. <laughs> Don't take your word. You believe he's supposed to knock back. 
He's supposed to knock back? Okay. Okay, maybe that is him knocking back, actually. Fine. Ah, found any I'm working. Alright, um. Okay. Let's go back to that puzzle again. Try to understand him knocking back. Uh. So if he knock once, let's say he he knocks back, but it goes it goes by so fast and we hear no sound. I feel like it's not working properly. It's not a lockpick. Now that you mention it, you added it to your list of things to try and make. Yeah, yeah, definitely. You should you should try. But I suspect you know making all those intricate little different pieces, different picks would be a lot of work. Uh, like making a full set of lockpicks might be uh, a big, big job. Oh, oh, okay. Maybe it's working right now. He knocked back three times. Wrong, but all right, all right, all right. We we are getting somewhere. So one, one, two. Oh, oh, I think I understand. So I knocked once. No, he knocked once. I added because it was plus. I added one and knocked twice. So he knocked three times. Now it's minus sign. So I have to decrease it by one. No. Nope. Wrong, but well, let's try this again. One, one. What if I do three? It didn't work. Wrong, but wrong. Blasted. Standard one will be pretty easy. Quad and Penta breaks might be a bit more challenging. You are sure you can find some inefficient way of doing it? I I don't know uh, how lockpicks work in detail. I'm sure you know a lot better than me. But I would absolutely love to see if you actually go ahead and make something like that. Let's try to start with three. Knocked once. Knock once. So maybe our first knock amount doesn't matter. Let's go with two. He knocks once. We go with two. No, it matters. It matters. So, plus, minus, plus. Let's start with three. Uh, now, three plus one. Oh, I get it. Three plus one is four. Four minus three would be one. Okay. All right. We had to. We absolutely had to start with three, in fact. Hey, hey that was all correct. right, of that's so cool. Correct, you dope. Rufus, is that you? What are we you got... doing out there? What do I know? Maybe I just enjoy we got kind of lucky. Come on in. Yamash Starting is with three. You. All right, uh, before we go on, I'm going to run the ads. If you're not a sub, you may get ads up to three minutes. Uh, hopefully not as long. Probably not, but uh, I shall be waiting here. And um, yeah, stay tuned. Thank you for your patience. You enjoyed knocking too? Okay, we have Ash boosts. Anyone else wants to boost? While we are on a break. Scald. Scald passing Witcher 2. Thank you for the boost again, Ash. Road Warden passes Icewind Dale and Two Worlds. Don't forget to drink water. Oh. Wars EAN just posted ah. a game of your choosing. Hi. Thank you for the opportunity. So what do I boost? What is the game of my choosing? The game of my choosing. There are some very cool games that are not getting mini boosts. 
Alamancer just boosted Skull. Hey! <laughs> Zoria? No. I usually do not boost games that already get regular support, dude. I, I boost games that are overlooked. Whenever I'm given, the ch given a chance to boost, I choose something that is largely overlooked. Like right now, I'm considering it's only by you. Well, it's by someone. There are tons of games here that no one boosts. Um, like I'm, I'm considering either Encased or Ballroom. Um, Broken Roads could be. You've been enjoying the heck out of Skull. I'm so much looking forward to playing that, Aeon. I'm glad you are enjoying it. Really hearing great things about it. Um, could be one of those. Could be Game Deck. Honestly, Game Deck, most of Game Deck boosts comes from me. Uh, and JFC, who has been boosting it on behalf of me. Because whenever he gave me the opportunity to choose a game to boost myself, I chose Game Deck, and at some point he just started boosting Game Deck. But I consider them my boost, you know? Like him giving me the chance to boost again. But uh, less, it's high compared to some of these. You could also go with Ultima 7. I think Ultima 7 is also largely ignored. Hmm, what to boost? I don't know. Cased. Which one's Ultima 7 again? Ultima 7 is uh, the Black Gates and the Serpent's Isle. Two big games. It's the one, the first one that turns in, that changes the camera angle to isometric from top down. And it's the first one with real time, kind of real time combat. I, I can bring up some screenshots if you want, Ash. Also, welcome back, everyone. I'm just trying to find a game to boost. Hi, kindly wanted me to select a game to boost. Um, you think you like that one? It's considered one of the best, I think. Along with Ultima 4, 7 is considered one of the best. It's one of my favorites, for sure. Graphics are good enough for me to actually enjoy them. You know, some of the older ones feel like a hassle with the graphics. Feel not so much fun to me, like the first four. Even though 4 is generally considered the best Ultima game. I mean, I could also boost Ultima Underworld, I guess. <laughs> Let's go with Baldrum. Let's go with Baldrum. Thank you, Pi. Alright, let's go back to the game. Rufus, pleased to see you. Battlefield like Ultima 5, it's not called off life upgrades. Yes, yeah, exactly. Wow. What you built up here is. It's not all bad. Yes, bye. Yes, recruitment operations are running smoothly. I must have not a spoiler. Uh, all right. Charisma. Or the fact that nobody likes being blown to smithereens. Tony? You? There's an action you can do with the lady. Ah, you seem to have met. Number See a funny Easter egg. This is number two, our spiritual guide. You can tell me what it is, Pi. Number two? That must be a joke. Yeah, why am I only number two? But now, we have <laughs> more than 25 people in our couch. You Thank mean you. 26. Precisely. Although that is counting the three train Dovins, Ashley. And you're complaining about your number? You're training dolphins? 
That's my job here. Got a problem with that? Ah, I can see how under Tony's care, even peaceful dolphins might be transformed into bloodthirsty implements of destruction. But what's the point of that? I mean, how can trained dolphins possibly help you to capture an elevator headed for orbit? We've got to work with whatever we can get. Which appears to be especially true for spiritual guides. First, we were going for flying dragons, but that proved to be a fatal mistake. That's what I kept telling number 27. You want me to figure it out myself? Just wouldn't listen. All right, I'll try. Okay, canister. That we can siphon gas into that. Oh. <laughs> Maybe. Wading pool. All right. Hey, you. Should Uncle Rufus teach you a couple of tricks? Hmm. Oh, they're so happy. Sweet. The baby dolphins have their pool right next to the service hatch for the canteen. Isn't that a little unsafe? How was I to know you'd crop up here? They make cat food out of baby dolphins, don't they? If anything happens to them, I will kill you. I'm oh, serious. I no. will kill you. Uh, that wasn't a no. No, this is the tuna we need. These guys. We are gonna turn them into cat food. Is that rig? Yes, it is rig. <laughs> Such a cool emote. Jump through this tire into the service hatch. What's that supposed to be? Um, nothing. I want to teach the baby dolphins a couple of tricks. You want to do what? Oh, did I say teach? Show. Of course, I meant show. I want to show them a couple of tricks to cheer them up. I don't want them to end up depressed like their parents. If anything happens to them, I will kill you. I'm serious. I will kill you. The nice lady didn't say that. Once she sees how great you are at jumping through the burning hoops, she'll be blown away. So let's go. Alley oop! Hmm, they still need a little incentive. Incentive? Like bait fish? I can barbecue later on the glowing remains of the organon. We you put this here? What have you got there? Are those new supplies? Hmm, maybe. Can you prepare anything out of this? Ow. Don't hold those two toes to the service hatch. The baby dolphins over there really love them, you know. They would jump right onto my stove, which, in principle, would be so bad. After all, you can make tasty cat food from baby dolphins. But the nice young lady pointed out to me that the baby dolphins are part of the supplies. What nice young lady? Here, fishy fishy. <laughs> they seem to really love the bait. Sweet. I should keep that in the back of my mind in case I ever want to. Yeah, but where do I where do I put it? Where There's no need to wash my stuff. I want to board a submersible, not open a flower shop. Um, I can barbecue on the glow. I manage. You even have a kitchen? Certainly. We have to supply our troops somehow. Wow, that's more than I would have expected of you. What do you think? We aren't just playing around. What's a new friend like an orange juice, Janos? Not now, Mama. <laughs> I would actually. Hey, Janos. Ah, Rufus, that does organ on and show on. How did you manage to mobilize so many people in such a short time? I think they are just used to having a planet under their feet. And I also promised them t-shirts with funny prints if we win. What's Tony doing here? You know number 26. She joins a rebellion because someone destroyed her hometown. Yeah, I know. The Organon. No, no, not the Organon. Somebody called Evan Bastard. Never heard of him. It's us. What's up with those torpedo dolphins? Cool, aren't they? If you need them, talk to number 26. But don't expect too much. I had to share the torpedo equipment to order pizza for all of us. 
You sold all the torpedo equipment? Yes, in the gadget shop in the floating black market. The chopper mat gave me fireproof in as a bonus. Who bought your torpedo equipment? The chopper mat, just in time before the chop closed. Okay. So the, the robot that we scammed now has dangerous torpedo equipment installed and we are supposed to break into its shop. Amazing. Uh, Donna is hiding underwater. Hm. I almost wish I hadn't showed the torpedo equipment. On the other hand, the peach of us very good. Very cheesy with the pepperoni. Isn't it a little too risky to operate directly under the nose of the Organon? Oh, uh, speaking of which, you got a booger. A booger? Ooh, icky, icky, icky. But that is exactly the point. You can't see right under your nose and down here in the shoeish, nobody wants to smell either. We are even almost out of air fresheners. Oh, I'm off to hunt some mercy. Hey, Marza, welcome. Revolution. Happy Tuesday. Revolution. That just screams for a brilliant maneuver. That just screams for a brilliant maneuver. <laughs> My dolphinese is so accent free, it leaves them They're speechless. Well. They're well. are making good progress, so having fun. How are you, Marcel? They're depressed. <laughs> I can understand that if you're their trainer. Maybe I should just break a couple of your bones. I think that might cheer them up. They love physical comedy. They do? Somehow, I don't think that will cheer them up. Well, look who came toddling after me. See? You've never been able to There's some Anna's quest earlier. Magnetism. No, Keep I don't short, think so. Okay. I have a job to do here that needs my Is that a point and click? Guarding dolphins? Keeping down my lunch. What are you doing here anyway? I could ask you the same thing. Didn't you want to go to Elysium with that Gloria? Her name is Goal. And where is Goal? Has she already succumbed to one of your brilliant maneuvers? Did you accidentally toss her out of a burning hot air balloon? Far from it. It was an escape pod. Or did you saw her into yeah, pieces? Yeah, okay. Not literally. Goal is waiting outside. And she's in good health. Published by Dave Dalek, developed by some in the German studio. 2051. Uh, what's the name? Anna's Quests. Let me write it down. Next to the other things that I wrote down to remember, which I promptly forgot that I wrote down. But regardless, it's written down now. I'm gonna check it out. Marta, thank you. Whether you believe it or not, I am the leader. Oh, heavens. Just like in my worst nightmare. <laughs> oh, yeah. So you still dream of me. I was in therapy because of that. Well, as much as I'd love to talk about your fantasies of me, your dream man has an important mission. Oh. You won't believe everything that's happened to me. Let me guess. You were almost in Elysium, and then your good nature got in the way once again. How did you know that? Because that's the way this conversation always goes. Next, I say, <laughs> that's what you said the last time. And you say... But it really happened that way this time. Exactly. And even if you are about to say the opposite, you are never going to change. But I have changed. <laughs> Darn it. You didn't really change, Rufus. The a dolphin pool needs to be cleaned again. Recruit. Excuse me? I hope I misheard that. But Tony, I am the leader here after all. I have to make sure that everything runs smoothly. And I can't show you preferential treatment just because we used to be together. That is... Is there a problem, Rufus? I don't think you have your team under control, Yanosh. Number 26 here actually attempted to contradict me just now. Oh, attempted to contradict? I must say, number 26. If the boss gives you an order, then you must obey. But... No butch, recruit! Oh, aye, aye, boss. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. I was wrong. 
This is a lot worse than my nightmare. Oh, and by the way, I want my coffee black for the meeting, Recruit. You cannot be serious. Yanosh. Recruit! You're out of your minds. I am not your... Recruit! Oh, and don't spill any, Recruit. You're digging your own grave. <laughs> yeah, whatever. It's worth it. How did you, you didn't? Uh, I did, and, and, and boop, you have a event? Call it what you want. I just thought my experience... Wait, why am I skipping? I never... So you do owe some uh, of your skills to me. I thought this was an option I took that. earlier. I skipped all that Great new stuff. Here. Beat it. Drop and I'm give sorry. me 20, recruit. Don't push your luck. Hey, this is Civil War, Tony. Every little bit of flab on your thighs could mean the death of one of our comrades. You miserable! Uh-oh. <laughs> you were killed by an ugly dragon. Utterly overpowered by the sheer evilness of the hideous creature, our dear hero perished and was no more. Uh, <laughs> I don't have a save though. Is, is this... <laughs> is this the easter egg? Let's quit. It actually quit the game. I didn't expect that to actually quit the game. <laughs> oh, I don't have a save. Hi, why didn't you tell me to save? Before doing that, you should have warned me. Look at where we are. Oh, this is terrible. This is so terrible. <laughs> I am like several hours behind. Ah, uh, no, I, I cannot... Okay. So, I cannot make... I cannot go back to where I was in half an hour. Uh, I would I would end in half an hour, and I cannot get back to there in half an hour. So, what we are going to do is I'm going to end a little early. That was hilarious, and I don't regret it. But I cannot continue from here right now. I'm gonna end. I'm going to get to where I was off stream and we are going to continue from from that point uh, tomorrow it will have to happen I'm sorry because I, I I cannot get there in half an hour there's just a lot to do up uh, search chat sorry I I should have saved I should have saved um, it's my fault but yeah I I cannot get there so we are gonna call it <laughs> that was hilarious though i love it killed by the evil dragon all right let's find someone to raid it was hilarious yeah it is so much you know unforgiving there is a similar easter egg in monkey island one and uh you can recover from that you can recover from that but not from this one crazy <laughs> oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to get back there for tomorrow's stream. Let's see if anyone's playing the Ponya. No. Thank you for being here, everyone. Eleron is actually playing Black Geyser, which is a game I'm really interested in. He's playing Black Geyser on the GOG channel. 
uh, we could go there and say hi. I've been really interested in this game, but you know, it's not really get, getting much interest and support on stream, so let's go and see the game a little bit. Maybe, <clears throat> maybe it will generate some interest. Let's go there. Say hi to our our one is a great, uh, great GOG streamer. He, you know, he plays the ND with the viewers with his groups. He plays a lot of uh, CRPGs, all all the classic good ones. He does a lot of role playing stuff, uh, so always a treat to see his contents and uh, really cool to see Black Dizer. So yeah, uh, I'm sorry for the abrupt end, but I was going to end soon anyway. Uh, it was a hilarious stopping point. I'm gonna get back to where we were off stream. Hopefully I can remember what I did. And we are going to continue from that point. Uh, tomorrow. Continue the Ponya. Thank you so much for being here today. So many follows. A maniacal raid. No matter raid. And the porcelain ghoul raid. Any other? And... Uh, Hi, with the bits, GM Farmer with the bits, the resubs, uh, gift subs, it was crazy. Thank you everybody for being here, keeping me company, uh, chatting and lurking and doing whatever you enjoy doing here. Hopefully you had a good stream, hopefully you are enjoying the Ponya, and hopefully you come back for more the Ponya tomorrow. Until then, take care of yourselves and be well, and goodbye for now.